It's okay. Come, the stars await, and we mustn't keep them. Captain. expanse. It's easy to forget sometimes. You can say that again. But we made it. To Zega Grande Skydom. Now we're a step closer to finishing our journey! Yeah. It's nice we're getting closer to our goal and everything. But... I was thinking, wouldn't it be wonderful if our adventures never ended? To me, seeing the world with everyone is so much fun. I sort of wish that it could go on forever and ever. You read my mind. Steady again. Let's go check on the others. Um, Catalina? What is it, Lyria? What do you think is out there? At the end of the Sky Realm, I mean. A wall, maybe? <laughs> if there is, it'd be pretty tall. Oh, now that you bring it up. I guess I've never thought about it before. Hey, can I ask you something? What do you think is at the end of the world? We'll find out when we get there. <laughs> I knew you'd say something like that. <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, we know there's at least two things waiting for us out there. First is Estelucia. Island of the Astros, and second is your dad. I can't imagine what adventures we're in for next. We'll just have to keep going and see for ourselves. <laughs> you and Lyria are totally in sync. <laughs> You're certainly in high spirits, Lyria. <laughs> I'm just excited to start a brand new adventure. Me too. Feel that wind flowing through your hair. <laughs> it does have a certain nostalgic quality to it. Wait, 
Does that mean you've been to the Skydome before, Rosetta? Oh, sweetie. <laughs> I can't start giving away my secrets now. Aw, you never give me a straight answer. Because you've got no filter. Maybe you'll understand when you're older. Zip it! I've told you a bunch of times, stop treating me like a baby! She's right, Rackham. Eo is a mature, sophisticated lady. Two against one ain't fair. I'm counting on you, Eo. And you won't be disappointed. My magic's getting stronger every day. Ugh, if anybody's the immature one, it's Rackham. Oh, Eo. Just forget about him. Think about these new skies we get to explore. New Skydom. Reminds me of my younger days. Got me falling in love with the skies all over again. But you can rest easy. I'm keeping an eye on the horizon. Anything comes close to the ship, and you'll be the first to know. Think we'll see monsters? Hard to say. But if I know these airways, the skies will turn on you when you least expect it. Why don't you go check on the rest of the crew? I got things covered up here. We're on the verge of entering a new Skydom. No knees up now, Captain. <laughs> Seems like everyone's in high spirits. Should be seeing signs of civilization soon. I hope the island has a hotel. What? Huh? Heads up! We got monsters! <laughs> How'd I miss a whole flock of wyverns? Are they hiding in the clouds? Eo! Rosetta! You're too heavy on the lizards on the port side! On it! Healing jerk! Looking good! Just like that! Nice move, bud! This should do it! Yeah. Show him! How's this? Perfect! Now we can make a break for Lyria! Captain, go to Lyria! Showed those losers. <laughs> <laughs> you can't mess with the best. <sighs> <laughs> we did it.
yourself! Lyria, what gives? Why's Bahamut gone all bonkers? I don't know. I thought I heard a voice and... and, and this happened. Just hold on. We'll try to get him under control again. Please hear me, Bahamut! We've got to! Yeah. How are we gonna stay airborne with him smacking us around? Can we do something? In a full-blown nice. red case. I'm afraid we'll have no luck reasoning with him now. Then knock the damn thing out if you have to. He's ripping up my ship! Ready for action! I think it's working! Leary, we'll hold it back. You focus on calming it. Just like that! On my mark! <laughs>
now. <sighs> Sheesh. Really had me worried there. I... Lyria's voice echoed through the darkness. It was familiar. Painfully familiar. Just like the day we met, before this whole long journey began. Though I could barely use my sword, I tried to protect Lyria from the Empire. I almost died. But then... You protected me. Now it's my turn to save you. Take my power. Let it guide you. Let it become your strength. I know you can do this. Our lives are linked. While I may not fully understand how, Lyria gave half her life to save me. Her gift gave me the push I needed to pursue my own quest, finding Estelusia, Island of the Astrals. It was a fabled place at the end of the sky, where dreams are said to come true. Lyria and I not to mention our ever-growing crew, are still continuing our search. But someday... Someday we'll find it. Then, finally, the life link between us will... Huh? Where... am I? Oh, right. Lyria fell from the ship. Then Vern and I leapt after her. You gotta wake up! Come on! Open your eyes! I said wake up! You okay, buddy? to death, you know? <laughs> oh. Having that dream about Lyria <laughs> again? Maybe you bumped your head on the way down. Uh, speaking of Lyria, I didn't see where she fell. She should be close. Let's search the area. Dang. This forest is huge! Don't get us lost, okay, pal? Ugh. I bet everybody's worried sick. Wonder when we'll see them again. Looking good! Now we can move on! Just 
like that! I know! This should do it! Help this! people. We can take it out and our attack. Bring it away! Nice! Let's do this! Looking good! Just like that! Bring it away! Time to shine! On me! Yeah! Follow it! Look at my sights! That was fun! The training's paying uh, off, Captain. Like that. Uh, don't hold back! Uh, 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 uh,
I've got a bad feeling about this. Looking good. Just like that. Oh, you're on my mark. Oh, this. Now's our chance. But you're done. He wants to the three. You said it. Right. Let's move on. You guys. Now's our chance. On me. Tempest Flame. Catalina, I'll protect you. Go into the ice and beyond! Back up! Loud and clear! Looking good! I know! Catch this! Bring it! Down first! Looking good! Just like that. Over here. We're just running out of juice. Little days out. Looking good. Just like that. You guys rock, Captain. Oh, glad we made it in time. Forgive me for being late, Captain. Hope you saved some fun for me. Ooh, looks like everyone's no worse for wear. Oh, thanks for the save, Oigan. Lyria, about what happened with Bahamut. Do you have it under control now? Yes, I think I do. Uh, why'd it flip out on us? I don't really know. Well, hanging out here isn't gonna help. How about we head back to the Grand Cipher? I'm with Eo. Better get moving before more monsters get the munchies. In that case, maybe we should follow this trail instead. I have a feeling it leads to a nearby town. Doesn't that sound like the perfect place to learn more about Zega Grande? Let's go check out that town, then. Yeah, that's a good idea. What we need right now is information. Then it's settled. Into town we go! Ah, oh, wonder if they got any plump, juicy apples. Oh, Vern, you're always thinking about food. <laughs> Look who's talking! Uh, my tummy always picks the worst time to growl. <laughs> you heard Lyria's stomach. Let's go find that town. Oh, wonder what kind of city it'll be. Can't wait to find out. Know what I'm wondering? How'd you guys fall from that high up without a scratch? It's a miracle. Good question. Maybe the canopy broke our fall. In any case, awesome. we got lucky. Hey, any skyfarer who tells you life ain't about luck is a liar Look, in my- I see buildings! <laughs> Seems like a pleasant place to unwind. Only one way to find out. Let's go! Check out the airships. Probably got a strong trade network going. Kind of reminds me of good old Port Breeze. We should look for a place where Lyria can rest. Me? But I feel fine. 
fine. You've had a rough afternoon today. You shouldn't push yourself too hard. I know, but we're in a brand new town and I want to explore it with everyone. Well, Captain? Enjoy some time to yourselves, everyone. Yay! <laughs> Where you guys get your energy from? <laughs> if Lyria's up for a little excursion, then I don't see the harm in it. In the meantime, I'll grab the Grand Cipher. Should be a dock around here somewhere. As for me, I'm hankering to try the local brews they got in these parts. We just got here and you already need a drink? What's with you, geezers? What? I deserve a refreshing cocktail after a long hike. Ugh, you don't deserve anything. <laughs> You're all too much. Anyway, after exploring for a bit, let's meet back at that big building over there. Take a look around. I can't wait to explore. I love visiting new places for the first time. So done. <laughs> I have to say, you're a real lifesaver. Well then, see you next time. It's always a pleasure. Must be the ones Ciero mentioned. Let me take a peek at your gear. I'm glad we know where to look if we need to sharpen our weapon. You can say that again! Now! <laughs> to goof it off. This'll be interesting! Sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Maybe I can be a sophisticated lady, too. Gee, what a selection. 
I don't know what most of this stuff is for. Eugen's hmm. oh. already. Yeah. Ahoy, Captain. Enjoying yourself? Oh, brother. At least one of us is, that's for sure. Come here. Let you in on a tip I heard. Word is there's a village that runs a mining operation on a nearby island. It's got an altar dedicated to, get this, a primeval god. And when this god stirs up a wind, loads of ore gets exposed, ripe for the plucking. Then this town takes those mined ores to make the finest jewelry. We'd be rich if we got in on the action somehow. You're catching my drift? Anyway, gonna stay put and sniff around for more info. I'll let you know what I hear. See you later, Captain. One more for the road. <laughs> Rackham headed straight for the docks, huh? Huh. <laughs> Airship of that size is a first for me. But I reckon I can handle her. Uh, sorry for pushing you guys. <laughs> Shucks, it ain't nothing. I'll leave this spot empty, so go ahead and fly her in. Thanks a million. I'll get right on it. Rackham, hi! Well, look who it is. I managed to find a place that can patch up the Grand Cipher. Just got done haggling with him. Um, I'm sorry the ship got hurt. That was my fault. Whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? You had nothing to do with it. But I... Look, it was a random accident. No one could have known our dragon friend would go all crazy. It's not your fault, Lyria. Yep, no one's blaming you. Captain knows best. So quit feeling guilty about it, okay? Okay. Thanks for cheering me up. There's that smile. Besides, we're in a new Skydom. Let's see some more enthusiasm, huh? Anyway, I'd better go move the Grand Cipher before anything happens to her. Go have fun. I got the ship covered. Rosetta doing? Hi, Rosetta! Nice of you to drop by, Lyria. Come to see my part of town? Actually, I wanted to ask you how I could help the crew. Is that so? Well, I'd say there's no need to stress out about it. But I want to be useful and do my share. Oh, dear. <laughs> I think you might be overthinking this. Isn't there something I can do? Let's see. Guidebooks are pretty useful. Ever thought about writing one? Write my own guidebook? Just jot down the fun things you've seen and done. Whatever you want to share with us. Better than complaining all the time. That's like the opposite of being helpful. You're right. Okay, I'll write the best guidebook ever. I can't wait to read it. Such a refreshing breeze. Catalina, training again. Guess old military habits die hard, huh? Hi, Catalina! What you doing? Thought I might get in some training. I once spent hours practicing my strikes. Oh, no wonder you're a master swordswoman. <laughs> Not yet, I'm afraid. Maybe I'm halfway there at best. You're no slouch either, buddy. But I wonder who's better, 
You are Catalina. Probably Catalina. <laughs> it's hard to say at a glance, though it might be fun to cross swords sometime. <gasps> you mean like a sparring match? I wouldn't know who to root for. Then why not both? Oh, you're right! There's no rule that says I can only pick one side. Uh, Captain, before we proceed any further, I have just one thing. Make sure to check our mastery points from time to time. Battles may begin to feel tense if we don't sharpen our skills. Oh, that's how it's done. I love learning new stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, I think I get it. I'll practice day and night. I mustn't fall behind our captain after all. If you're done looking around, we can start heading to the meetup spot a little early. A meetup spot was somewhere around here, right? Are you done looking around? Yeah, I think I've seen everything. Same. Let's take a quick break while we wait for the others. Look, it's the Grand Cypher! Oh yeah! Rackham did say he'd bring her in for repairs. Can I tell you something? I heard what you did when I was falling off the ship. I felt so happy knowing you sprang to my rescue. We've been through a lot together. Visited new islands, met new people. It hasn't always been the safest trip, but you've always been there to protect me. I just wanted to say thank you. And since our lives are intertwined, let's make the most of our journey together. Yeah. <laughs> now my face feels a little hot. <laughs> Sorry, huh? kept y'all waiting. Cypher's officially in the shop. Nice work. Hey. Thanks, Rackham. So, we've got time to burn, it seems. Anyone want uh, Almost forgot this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You guys hear that? All right, I'm off. My rudeness. I uh, don't do well with lizards. Hey! I ain't no lizard! It, it can talk? I do beg your pardon. We didn't mean to startle you. And we certainly don't intend on starting any trouble. Actually, we're a crew of humble skyfarers. This is Vern. I assure you, he means no harm. If anything, he's quite the lovable dragon once you get to know him. Uh, you've got it all wrong, Catalina. I'm a cool dragon. Huh. Skyfarers, you say? Oh, allow me to introduce myself. My name is... Roland. You've got to help us. 
A tornado suddenly hit our village out of nowhere. A tornado? It's something of angered Tempil's primal beast? Huh? Remain here in Folka. I'll handle the rest. My apologies. It seems I'm needed elsewhere, so I'm afraid this is farewell for now. Hey, wait! He sure ran off in a hurry. And I heard him say primal beast. We should follow him. <laughs> what? There are still people stuck in Tempil! Oh, what do we do? So the altar suddenly lit up, you know? And the wind was like a... Whoosh! And that primeval god is not happy. Slow down, take a few deep breaths, and tell me exactly what happened. Okay, okay, I'm calm. An altar, fierce winds, and what they call a primeval god. Sound familiar? Yeah, it does. Smells fishy. It's gotta be connected to Bahamut going ballistic on us. Glasses know something we don't. Wanna see if we can tag along? He could lead us to a clue. What do you think, Captain? Well, we can't ignore people in trouble. Exacto mundo. Right then. I know what I have to do. Time to get moving. Um, excuse me. Ah, hello again. The situation is a bit out of hand, as you can see. If you need something from me, can it wait? I must leave town for a spell. Then I'll cut to the chase. Allow us to join you. Say that again? It seems you're in a predicament. Depending on the situation, we could be of help. I appreciate the offer, I really do, but... You mentioned a primal beast, right? If that's the problem, we want to lend a hand. We had our own snag as soon as we arrived in this skydom. Bet you're round of drinks, whatever you're facing has to do with us, too. Simply put, our goals are aligned. It takes two to tango, wouldn't you say? I don't know. Hmm. Though, more hands would certainly be welcome. Very well. I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. Yay! Anything can happen out there. You should get organized before we head out. I was itching for some action. See that counter? That's where we can pick up new quests. Let's check back often, okay? You set! That dude's gonna need serious help! The ship will depart shortly. Is everyone ready? Yep. We're good to go. Good. All aboard the airship. There's no time to waste.
Do your thing, autopilot. So, I bet you're wondering who I am. Mm -hmm. I work for the Church of Folka, mostly as a vicar. Call me Roland. I'm Catalina, protector of this crew. Name's Rackham. Cheers. And I'm Eo. Eugen here. Rosetta. You can call me Ver. I'm Lyria. Nice to meet you. And finally, this is our captain. Wow. I can't imagine captaining a crew at your age. <laughs> well, I'm not exactly a slouch myself. You see, I'm kind of a Mr. Fix-It, handling all the odd jobs after church. From furniture repair to marriage counseling, I can mend it all. Results guaranteed! When Roland's on the case, nothing is impossible! <laughs> Too dramatic, huh? This guy's a few apples short of a bushel. He'll hear you, dummy! Glad you're with us! High five, fix it, dude! Uh, dude? <laughs> Once again, my name is Roland. Yep. Heard you the first time. Cheers, fix it, dude. But it's rolling. Huh? <laughs> 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 We've got some time before we reach Tempeel, so would you mind checking on the others? She's not the most luxurious ship, but I assure you she's skyworthy. Wow, this part of the sky is full of islands. Indeed, they form the archipelago, and one of them is home to Folka. So this other island we're flying to, will we be arriving soon? Yes, we'll be there shortly. I just hope the islanders are evacuating as we speak. You said we're going to Tempeel, right? What kind of place is it? It's a bustling mining village. All the rare metals they dig up put them on the map. What? Does anyone else see that? I mean, the wind around the island. You can actually see it. Huh, yeah. Why is it all weird? <sighs> the gales are reaching us from this distance? I suppose that confirms my suspicions. Should be more people here. Ah. Roland, we should talk. I see. The abnormal winds agitated the goblins, who in turn attacked the islanders. We managed to escape, but the others. I pray the worst hasn't befallen them. Try not to worry too much. Just leave everything to Mr. Fix It. Thank you. I'll go spread the word. That 
being said, I can't just leave these people here unprotected. What should I do? He needs our aid, Captain. Did somebody call for goblin exterminators? We'll handle the goblins. Are you sure? That'd certainly take a load off my shoulders. Talk about having the right crew for the job. Thanks a lot. I'll come find you after I get all these people aboard the airship. If you happen to see any more islanders out there, could you give them assistance? Yep, you got it! Oh, I almost forgot to give you this. If anything happens, we can communicate with each other using this device. We can talk on this thing? Looks like a flower glued to a box. It's a type of transceiver. It'll allow us to talk over long distances. Aren't transceivers expensive? Are you sure you want to give us one? Yep, don't worry. I didn't pay for it. Since I put it together myself. Ah, check this out. It even has a nifty light attachment. Why don't you turn it on, Vern, when you want to grab everyone's attention? Might come in handy. Nice. You got skills, fix it, dude. <sighs> it's rolling. Huh. Who'd have thunk you could make sweet gizmos like this? Thank you. We'll definitely make good use of it. Follow that road, and it'll take you to Tempeel. Please, help anyone you see. I'm counting on you. Move it, people! Sabotage! Just a moment! This here is hallowed ground. A special aura keeps the monsters at bay. If you need to rest, Find this crystal. You can even stock up on supplies and fix up your weapons. We're counting on you. But it won't stay that way for long. Please, do everything you can to free them. <laughs> you got that right. Did you like that? That's the spirit of the evil pet! Hold it! Heads up! Please get it! A well-oiled machine! I've got even bigger spells! Get it! 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 You're the best, Rackham. Don't get mushy on me. We got this! Yes! On my mark! Hey, kudos! Don't hold back! Don't move! Look and get him! Never taste it, lad! Armor break! There. That's the last of them. Now to set the captured people free. Come here, look. Everyone, get on board! We've been... safe? Io. Take care of their injuries. I'm on it! Thank you. I'm just glad everyone's safe and sound. 
What would we have done without your crew? Skyfarers are something else. Thank you so much, everyone. But more settlements could be under attack. Better keep going. We gotta check on those people. Were the erratic winds causing the goblins to act violently? That's a big problem, if true. Goblins don't usually go berserk like average monsters. This is rolling. I think... More captives up ahead. Understood. Pick up the pace, everyone! Look alive! I'll support! Keep it up! Timberwolves! They've even learned how nope. to tame wolves. I'll be there soon. Yeah. Hold out as best as you can. Roger Dodge! Look at this! Rock it down! Looks like the goblins have hostages. We're on it. Good point. Please, do your best to the ship like that! Even for me, you win now. And open it! Hell yes! Send those puppies scampering! Oh, great! Looks like some of them can use magic too! Don't get sloppy now! Finished! Looking good! We better stay focused! No kidding! Well said! Just like that! Our cook is saving this one! Looking good! Roger! Just take it! You like that? Stuck the landing on that one! Yeah! Let's just focus on the path ahead. Looking good! They're weaker now! Heads up! Way ahead of you! Looking good! Keep it up! Very true! I won't fail you! One more group accounted for. Good! Give them back that sweet, sweet freedom! Oh! You're safe now! Hurry to the ship! Thank goodness! Don't give up, okay? I'm... alive? You're going to be fine. Can you walk, miss? Thank you, thank you, thank you! You did it! You saved everyone! Thank you! Oh no, the community by the waterfront is under attack! Roger that! Next up is the waterfront! Thanks, Dad! Nice work! Heads up. Ready for action! Oh no, oh, the bridges are in pieces! We'll have to get our feet wet. Mind where you step, everyone. Take them out! I'm moving as fast as I can. Break it! Keep the goblins occupied. We will, Roland. We just focus Looking on flying. Good. Yes. Oh, yeah. Never mind. You're right. I'll put my trust in you, Skyfair. On my mark. We fight as one! Oh, great. Close, no, close. Shoot both. They'll need time to reload. That's when we charge. Ever tasted lead? Looking good. You're weaker now. Looking good. Catch this. Follow me. Watch this. Good shot, Eo. You don't get caught. No, we fight us. Looking good. We've made a decent dent in their number. Keep at it. Come on, those poor people are waiting for us. This goblin looks tough. Please, be careful. Tough, huh? I guess he works out in his spare time. So, who's got the bigger guts, him or you? Check this out. I mean, it's me, right? Watch out! This isn't your average goblin. You're weaker now! Looking good. Just like that. Take him. No, I'm on it.
We've cleared the area. It should be safe to free the captives. Hey, that was some nice... Thank goodness everyone's okay. Quickly, get on board! Don't worry, you're in good hands now. Oh, thanks. I was so scared. You did a great job holding out. Hoo-hoo, <laughs> what a show! I'm so pumped up right now! Uh, maybe I healed him a little too much. Those poor folk are safe thanks to you. Great job, everyone. <laughs> All the day's work. Now, we should return to our search. Huh? What the... Heavens help us. There are others who haven't made it out yet. Oh no, this is awful. You have to rescue them. I'll lead the way. God, we'll speed ahead, everybody. I pray we're not too late. We made it, Roland. About to start fumigating the place. An opening! Thanks, buddy. Let's put my mind in it. Buddy? Seriously? I'm at least five years older than you. You don't want to be here. Oh, 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 Push through! Perfect team! That was nothing! Still got it! Looking good! Hit them now! Got it! Got it. Got I love when a plan comes together! I guess so! Yeah! We got the stuff! Yeah. Brothers or something? <laughs> they should have sent more than a trio. They're weaker now. It's not over yet. Don't expend all your magic. I'm old enough to manage my mana. Thank you very much. Just to see. Back in the game. Looking good. You guys, we're traveling Skyfarers, and we're here to rescue you. Chin up, everyone. Everything's going to be all right. Wait, was that Roland? Guess we really are saved. Let's quickly get you aboard Roland's ship. No, wait. Listen to me. We fled from the Goblin Fortress that lies deep in the nearby ruins. But our friends are still in there, and they can't make it out on their own. What's the call?
Let's get those people out of there. <laughs> I knew you'd say that. Come in, fix it, dude. Roll in here. What can Roland do for you? We're gonna break some people out of some goblin fortress. So take care of things here. Got it. I know this isn't what you signed up for, but just be careful in there. Will do! Who's ready to do this? Y'all think this is the goblin fort we're looking for? Gives me the willies. Be on guard. Oh! We meet again! Can I offer you a nice knick-knack in these trying times? It's eerily quiet. Stop it! That sounded like a kid! Hurry! Is this like a coliseum? This place is crawling with goblins. It doesn't seem like they want to scuffle. No! Run! Get out while you still can!
one more. We fight us. Looking good. Watch out. Understood. <laughs> On me. Look yep. out. Just like that. Go. They're weaker now. Thanks. Here goes. On me! Tempest Flame! Ha! Nothing yet! Breaking leg! Leave it to me! Go for it! to the eye! On to the oh, next. Right. Lightning Light eradication! We're not going to be us. Let's do this. Looking good. Close call. We got this. We got him. Just like that. This is why we're the best. Don't hold back. Looks like it's losing steam. We should strike now. Looking good. We fight us just like that. I got him. On me. Looking good. No grumpy gobble's gonna one up us. Throughout the battle? Yes, I'm sure of it. It has to be Tempiel's primal beast. Bingo. Guess this is where the real battle starts. Hello? Is everyone all right? What happened to the hostages in the fortress? Everyone's fine. They just need to rest. you all enough so what do you guys say to meeting the blowhard stirring up this storm wait what are you talking about rackham told you before we left folka remember the problem with the primal is our problem too i don't know about this maybe it's best to leave well enough alone but if we don't calm down the primal beast the situation on the island is only going to get worse. I hear what you're saying, but... Trust us. Captain. All right, I understand. I'm sure veteran Skyfarers know what they're doing. But if it gets risky, there's no shame in retreat. I still owe you a reward. You don't have to tell us twice. Thanks for the concern. Sit tight. The least I can do is drop you off a little closer. <laughs> Minds you of our showdown with Tiamat, doesn't it? I was wondering why this felt so familiar. Man, those people. 
people we saved. So Thanks for waiting, everyone. Save the place You're great. Yet. Our job isn't over yet. Those winds are still a big problem. They're not wrong. Looks like a mining setup. Neat. The winds have been dead. Now they're foreboding. Whoa! This place gets way bigger on the inside. Whoa. Look, everyone! Some sort of altar? Seems that way. But if we leave them be, they'll just try to ransack the town again. Prepare now! Excellent collaboration. Uh, I think I'm having deja vu. But there's another lever here. Hurry! The altar should be down this path. It's the home stretch! Go, go, go! Oh, crud! Watch out! This thing's not gonna hold up much longer! You gotta be kidding! Jump for it! Wait, what? Look out! We can take refuge in the back cave! Hurry! The altar should be down this path. It's the home stretch! This thing's not gonna hold up much longer! You gotta be kidding! Jump for it! Wait, what? This is insane! Look out! We can take refuge in the back cave! Lyria, are you hurt? No. Huh? I think. Altars above us, huh? Hope we've all got our hike. Haven't we get through enough of this already? It's not the only way left us up. Either we move it or lose it, folks. <sighs> Poor thing. Stuck in a ceaseless rampage. It's suffering a big deal. Be ready for a fight. Yeah, come on. This ain't our first rodeo. 
Are you expecting something different? You can tell primal beasts were weapons created by assholes. The powers are capable of untold destruction. But after the war, they abandoned us here in the sky. Some took to the land. Some were deer. Still others found a home alongside sky flowers and helped advance great civilization. How callous it is to twist this creative soul into an instrument of destruction. Payback's on its way. Darn right. Just don't get sloppy. The best thing means business. Here it comes. I promise we'll save you. Magic reserves are crazy. It keeps winning attack after attack at us. Something about Puritan's power feels unnatural. What do you mean? I'm not sure, but something isn't right. Back in the game. I support Lyria. Don't break over yet. The time is right. Come on. Got it. All the way. Come on. Just try to come to me. Let's make this swift. Thank 
you. And that's a wrap, folks. Booyah! Let's get off this rock and give Fix-It Dude the good news. Hold it. You guys see that ship? Ruby red for the hull? Sticks out like a sore thumb, don't it? It doesn't. It's not Lyria's doing. This can't be. Hey. Lyria! What's wrong? It wasn't me. I didn't. I couldn't stop it. Friends of ours, I'd wager. Hmm. Now they look like a fun bunch to tangle with. Do not deviate from the mission. We are simply here for a meet and greet. And you are? We've been waiting for you, Shaman of Salvation. Now, would you be so kind as to join us? <laughs> If you value your life, you'll leave us alone! Oh, fancy a challenge, huh? Fine, have it your way. I'll end this in 90 seconds. I expected more fight. Brave time's up.
O shaman of salvation, long have we waited for this day. What? Shaman? Me? How uncanny. So much in common with the blue butterfly and Seed Hollow's energy. Oh, my apologies. You must be bewildered by this uh, disrespectful I... treatment. I... Who the heck are you? And what do you want from us? Oh. How rude of me. You may call me Lilith. They, the pilgrims of Avia. I, their shepherd. And I will not rest. Not until we open the path to Utopia. Estelucia. Utopia? just said Estelucia, but that's the same place we're headed. Ah, truly? Our goals eclipse one another. Then I needn't prattle on. This meeting has proven quite serendipitous. I promise to take care of everything. Now, dear Sean, prepare yourself for glory. For a grand pilgrimage awaits us. We shall pave a new path to Estelucia. I don't think so! You don't get to make the rules on my watch! You fuck me! It... Let us return. You are unworthy.
Yeah. Good. In that case, better to let everyone know you're up. Cat's been beside herself. We can't afford to stop. We have to save Lyria. Whoa, try to cool down there, Cat. But I promised her. I promised her I would show her the outside world, no matter the danger. What if I can't protect her? What if I can't get her back? I refuse to break my vow. We know how you feel, but we can't jump the gun here, not without knowing more. Yeah, that guy was tough. We need a plan. Otherwise, he'll just mop the floor with us again. No matter. We can't stop until we have Lyria back. Right. We're coming, Lyria. Oh, Catalina. <gasps> Captain! Glad you're back on your feet. You scared the hell out of us. I'm sorry, Captain. I wasn't strong enough to protect Lyria. Good news, folks! I got a lead on those ruffians who ambushed you! Really? Where did they take her? Tell me right now or else. Jeepers! Calm down, Catalina. Is that any way to say thanks for the help? Uh, of course. Sorry. It's quite all right. I know exactly how you feel, Catalina. With all you did for us, it's only fair that I do my part to help you. Besides, looking into the Church of Avia was fairly simple. A church? They did call themselves pilgrims. Oh! How are you feeling, Captain? Much better. Glad to hear it. It's important to take care of yourself. So where'd those zealots march off to? It seems like they're taking Lyria to Latanya Island. Where's that? Fret not. I'll show you the way myself. Whoa, slow down, champ. First of all, we're skyfarers. We can't be babysitting. See, we've severely underestimated you, Roland. <laughs> Look, the Church of Avia grows bolder by the day. They used force in Tempil and abducted Lyria, an innocent traveler. I cannot sit idly by and allow such deeds to go unpunished. I'm quite capable of handling myself in a fight, and will do my best to aid you. If I may? Every Skydom's got a bad bunch. If you're offering to help us with them, I won't say no. Hmm. Now, uh, about your ship. You know, the really big blue one? The Grand Cipher. Yes, that's it. The repairs on the Grand Cipher will soon be completed. I did a little work on it myself, and just wait until you see what I... installed. You what? No! Oh, silly me! I must have been rambling about something else. Moving right along. I took the liberty of procuring a new weapon and some armor for you, Captain. Your current gear has certainly seen better days, after all. That's real nice of ya! I hate to imagine Folka's fate if your crew hadn't shown up when it did. These small tokens of appreciation are hardly enough to convey our gratitude. <laughs> well, thanks all the same, Fix-It Dude. It's Roland. We're grateful for all you've done, Roland. Alright, let's get a move on. 
Sure. Let me pack my things and I'll meet you by the dock. See you soon. Lilith. Enough is enough. We'll save her, no matter what. Of course. I don't care how strong they are. I'm not... We're not giving up. Look. Lyria's grown so much since she met you. Almost every night, she would come and tell me about her day, and all the new things she experienced with you and the crew. And each time, I was more and more glad we all found ourselves on this journey together. I won't let it end here. I promised Lyria that we'd see the world. That we'd see the end of the skies. So I swear, we'll get her back. Together, as a crew. Lyria, don't get I up. hope Eugen's not beating himself up too much. Hey, Captain. Can you ever forgive me? For what? Sorry, but I gotta apologize. See, I had a bad feeling the second I saw that red ship. When you've been through as much as I have, you develop a sixth sense for danger. But I still ignored the warning bells. Damn it all. So much for calling myself a guardian. Can't protect a damn thing. Well, I ain't giving up on Lyria. I'm bringing her home. And nothing's gonna stop me. No, oh, they'll pay. I'll show them what an old vet can do. Rosetta's lost in thought. Tell me, Captain, how are you feeling today? Pretty good, actually. Ah, I see. I like that confidence. Thankfully, it looks like you've healed up just fine. But we can't wait around any longer. Our princess awaits her rescue. It's going to work out. Wow. Despite it... Hey, Captain. Say, you remember the promise I made with Lyria? We were gonna ask Rosetta to teach us how to put on makeup. I wonder if Lyria's crying right now. It must be scary being alone. I can't stand it! We have to save her! Lyria... Pardon me. I heard what happened with Lyria. I'm not much use in a fight myself, but maybe I can help in my own small way. Please, take this! Rackham looks ready to... 
You don't think they're gonna do anything to her, do you, Captain? Hope not. Uh, I don't think they want to actually hurt her. Not from what I saw. Good thing we know where that red ship is going. Grand Cypher will hunt it down in no time. But once we catch him, those punks are gonna pay for what they did. They can run, but they can't fly from the Grand Cypher. Not while I'm helmsman. We promised to meet up with Fix-It Dude. Let's head for the dock. Are you all ready for takeoff? I can leave at a moment's notice. I still have some business. Okay, do it. Are you... Prepped and ready. Excellent. Then let's cast off. What in blue blazes is this? Like what you see? It's the latest in ether cannon technology. You did this? That thing looks like a recipe for disaster. You bet it is. See, a merchant I know's been asking me to test it out. This flagship model employs ethereal mechanics to increase range, accuracy, velocity. took Roland for a weapons maniac. By the way, Captain, how is the lifelink between you and Lyria holding up? It seems okay. Yeah, I think so too. So basically... And since they share the same life force, a healthy Captain means a healthy Lyria. Isn't that right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Considering they called her a shaman, I doubt they're out to harm her. You're yanking my chain. That's incredible! See? I had the exact same reaction. Gosh, you guys are such dorks. I take back what I said. These ether cannons are pure magic. <laughs> It seems Roland has quite the silver tongue. Next stop, Lotania Island. Our target is obvious flagship, the Ameritat. Let's go rescue Lyria. Hey, fix it, dude. Who died and made you captain? That's Roland to you. Seems useful. Feel that? Wind's on our side. The Grand Cypher should get us there in no time. The Church of Avia, claiming Lyria was some kind of shaman of salvation, had ripped her away from us. We had no idea what they were after, much less what they had in store for Zega Grande. The most we could speculate there had to be a connection between Avia's appearance and the incidents with Bahamut and Furikan. At the very least, Roland had an idea of where they were taking Lyria. Motanya Island. on him. Good luck trying to outrun the Grand Cypher.
same there. Anything for salvation. If it's a fight they want, then it's a fight they'll get! You'll have to fight in close quarters. Anybody? Let's get fired! Prepare! I'll finish! Hit them now! Hold me! They're in my sights! You soar high, Captain! There's more where that came from! Your time! We've been breached! Deploy the droids to Bolsam! Prepare to intercept! Okay, so we're looking for the gun battery. Yeah, we know. We'll get rid of them. Stay focused.
like we're all accounted for. <sighs> My poor heart. That's impossible. Who are these people? How's the ship? Can she still fly? Sure can. Oh, I wish I had a ship as amazing as yours. Now, to put her to the test. That dead red ship zoomed into the cloud! We'll lose some visibility in there. Stay on your toes. into an ambush! I've had enough! Hey, Eugen! Cannon's up yet? I think we're good. Let's say I with a bear. I don't trust myself with this machine, but I can't worry about that right now. Easy. It sure beats getting pumped full of holes. It is what it is. Roland, bring us in. Brought you that. All hands, brace for impact. Against us. We must destroy the power regulator. Hey, that's 
down with it if we can't pull away somehow. Any good ideas? Destroying the engine seems effective enough. Actually, that might be our only option. Yes. Can you handle it? It's as good as done. Besides, Healing I don't feel like crashing today. Yeah. Close comb. some frightening firepower. I'm glad you're on my team. What can we say? Those bozos weren't even a challenge. All right, now to catch that ship. It's showtime, folks. Oh, 
me, Galanza. Alpha of the Silver Wolf Corps, and strongest in the land. You bastard. Watch where you stick that thing. Who cares about a dumb pile of wood? You see, all that matters... <laughs> ...is the last man standing. <laughs> At least give me a shot. Stay back, and you can't stop us! <laughs> Impressive. No one's ever made such short work of my unit before. I want answers, and you're going to give them to me. Why did you kidnap Miria? Why, you ask? Because I live to just try to might against the strong. Oh, this is going to be fun. That's a dumb excuse. I can't stand guys like him. Approach him carefully. Those attacks are hard to avoid. Might be better to buckle down and guard. You're weaker now! Breaking leg! Very well. I'll fit her! Feel the fight! Prepare for the Heal! <laughs> 
Speak like a beast with more impulse than sense. If you're lying on the ground bereft of life, how will you explain yourself to Our Lady? <clears throat> Point taken. I could use a nice nap. But as for you, <clears throat> the next time we meet face to face, only one of us will walk away. It'll be glorious! Dark so that just happened. Guys, that lady that 
was just here disappeared too. She has quite the talent. Yet another foe to keep in mind. Roland, what of the red ship? Don't you worry. I've got eyes on it. They're flying towards Mount Nagelith and... Whoa! <laughs> Old girl's taking too much damage. Hope she don't fall. Damn it! Just gave her a tune-up, too. Don't let us down, Grand Cypher. Take a little of this. Snowstorm? Whatever. It's not gonna stop us from finding Lyria. We chase after the red ship, straining to see through the flurries of snow. Lotania Island. Home to frosty mountains, treacherous ravines, and desolate tundra. Out here, it's just white, white, and more white. The ship shivers in the blasts of icy wind. This place has got just one message for us. Keep out. It's gonna get a little bumpy. Something. Roland? A word, please. I saw a light in the distance before the storm hit. It was like the one in Tempeel. If that light is what I think it is... You guessed right. It's where we'll find the island's altar. And Avia. So they aim to drive another primal beast to insanity? Be that as it may, Lyria is waiting for us. Now is not the time to speculate. Look, I know we gotta go, but the ship's hurting. We won't get far without repairs. With a blizzard like this, all we can do is wait till it dies down. I'll go on foot. In this weather? Through a mountain? Do you know how dangerous that is? If anything, it might be safer. There's an old monastery nearby. I plan to meet a friend by the Sanctum. With her leading the way, you'll arrive at the altar come rain, sleet, or snow. Then she's our only chance! Come on! The trails are infested with monsters. But after seeing your handiwork, I'm sure we have nothing to worry about. Oh, I'm not worried about that. Thing is, I can't leave the Grand Cypher unguarded. Then permit me to repair her in your stead. She'll be ready to fly in no time. 
Look, it's not that I don't trust you. Don't judge a book by its cover. I'm Mr. Fix-It, remember? Repairs are my specialty. She's in your hands. Well, if Captain's on board with it. You're such a crybaby, Rackham. You still can't leave the Grand Cypher's nest. Oh, give me a break. Seriously, it ain't like that. Roland, can I trust you with the Grand Cypher? <laughs> on my honor, I'll do everything in my power to patch her up. Okay, gang. Let's get going before we turn into popsicles. Lyria needs us! Day, travelers, although I bear no grudge against any of you, it would certainly behoove you to abandon your quest. I do beg your pardon. Milady, you were strictly ordered not to kill them. They went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Galanza and survived. This will merely slow them down a bit. But do keep a close eye on them. Ma'am. Now then, the Mountain considers your party to be uninvited guests. One wonders if Mother Nature will forgive this intrusion. I'm headed up to here with gravity. Hmm? Stop. Nobody move. Come 
mom never taught it any manners. Time for a quick etiquette lesson. Rolling. Copy. Those Avia jokesters intercepted us. Now we're at the bottom of some valley. Looking for a lot. My guess is signal doesn't stretch all the way down here. We're on our own for this one. Buckle up. Come on! I'm on it! Let's go! Let's hurry to the monastery! It's charging the over! Here's our chance! Give it heck! Couldn't see eye to eye. Oh well. R.I.P., buddy. Ugh, that's it. No more puzzles.
funds this entire trip. I've been thinking, what does the Church of Avia want with Lyria anyway? Their leader, Lilith, wants to go with the She must have caught on to Lyria's unique and valuable abilities. Whatever the reason, those tyrants abducted her. Oh, great. Even more ice. Keep your eyes open. The monsters could be hiding beneath the snow. Right hell on Look at him! Take him out! Don't let him beat him down! No I won't let you down! <laughs> this way should take us to the surface! You got this, you! Looks like no one's home. Whoa! Did they need a door this big? Wait. What's that sound? Did they follow us here? With the blizzard picking us outside, we have no choice but to fight them all. Here we go! Try that again, man. You're finished! Look alive! All support! Yeah. Sorry, not sorry. Stuck the landing on that one. <laughs> I'll always be by your side. Just like that. Take this! Come on! Okay, this. Got it. Locked out on that one. Keep your cool, will ya? We make quite the team. <laughs> Say more. Follow me. After you. It's gonna get real ugly. Traveling Skyfarers. I am Historia, Overseer of Malo's Monastery. Thank you for your assistance. You must be Roland's acquaintance. Indeed, I am. Did anyone from the Church of Avia come this way? Maybe a flashy red ship? Yes, and they've already disturbed the altar ahead. The primeval god it honors is most displeased. Then there really is a primal beast here as well. 
The god's anger manifests as a blistering white storm. I seek to quell its rage. Well, we're after those jerks that caused it. Maybe we could go together. The road forward is a sacred one, sealed to all but me. However, it is no place for outsiders. Lyria's our friend! She means a lot to us! Please, let us come with you! Hmm... You've got to help us! Oh? Do I now? At least you aren't lacking in bravado. Yes. That fire in your eyes speaks of great tenacity, an unquenchable resolve. Very well. Do as you like. Yes! Thank you. But be warned. Sacred grounds are not immune to the taint of malice. Do keep up. We won't hold you back. Lead the way. Oh, primeval god of Belfrost Dominion, bestow thy grace and guide us past the door of seclusion. I'm no stranger to ice-based spells, but this is something else entirely. <sighs> it is done. Come. the Padom Sanctum, wherein a primeval god resides. Took us forever and a half, but we made it! <sighs> Another door blocks our path. Allow me. O oh, primeval god of Belfrost's dominion, bestow thy grace and guide us past the door of seclusion. the welcome squad. I know how they're kicking when it's sub-zero. If my incantation is interrupted, the sigils will cease forming. It demands my fullest attention. Can you keep the rabble occupied? Understood. We'll protect you while you work your magic. Perhaps they find her intense magical capacity. All the more reason to stay focused. Come what may, we stand guard! Yeah! The to ten! Catch this! Never tasted lead! Got him! Look out! Take that! This. Just watch! Take it away! Water break! Finish! It'll hurt! Heed these ancient words. Is that the water spirit? Did it expect the life to survive this fun?
Could you defend me? for my earlier incivility. Your skill is unquestionable. <laughs> Wait till you see me get serious. I expect to be impressed. The blizzard stopped. An ill omen. We must hurry. That's one sturdy looking door. But no match for me. Oh, primeval god of Belfrost's dominion, bestow thy grace and guide us past the door of seclusion. your eyes on that one. It's deadlier than the rest. Protect Historia! No fair! It's cold and spotty! Look out! There comes more from the grid! Gotcha! This will hurt!
It would be a shame to stop now. <sighs> At long last. The altar lies ahead.
Is it that Lyria? Another foe. Hysteria! You knave! What did you do to Lyria? Answer! I wouldn't interfere if I were you. Protect us. Lyria is staying one. with us. Lyria, I know you're in there. Why did you kidnap Lyria? <laughs> oh, now he's got nothing to say. I don't like it, but we have ways of making him talk. You will pay dearly! <laughs> 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 Does this guy eat meal for breakfast? He's strong as hell! First Alonza, now this dude. Where does Avia find these monsters? His name is Id, one of Avia's top three. Said to be this guy that is strongest. No wonder he's so tough. But why would a man of his ferocity obey the church? He may be Lilith's son. Details escape me, but it would explain much. Make Jesus little teeth, huh? Of course, Mom is great at all, but think for yourself, man. Oh, we must get to her. That guy's too good. They get a clean hit on him. <laughs> God remain unquelled. The sun will never kiss these guys again. All oh, my magic shall be with you. Thanks, Historia. We can take it from here. Come on, everyone. Lyria's freedom is on the line. Zipping around like white. Can't get crosshairs on it. Silence movement. Set around Scuria like a pig on a spit. Never tasted lead? I'm savoring the moment. I 
farmer. Simple, but effective.
One fell blow, and it could crush any of us. The ice formations. Perhaps they hold the key to survival. Again. Oh, goody. You don't sound very happy. Did something happen? Lyria. 
She... Uh, hang in there. I'll come grab you guys ASAP. <sighs> Captain... That's a bitter pill to swallow. It was a pitiful outcome, despite my presence. No, even I assumed they wouldn't control primal... I mean, the primeval gods. And there's the matter of Lyria's odd behavior. Her eyes were empty, as if her soul were caged. What's more, the blue choker she wore did not sit right with me. A blue choker? Like a collar around her neck? Could it be... Could it be what, Roland? Is it a clue? Uh, possibly. Just a story I heard a while back. If, uh, rumors are to be believed, the Church of Avia has been toying with a forbidden implement. Uh, what now? The Mind Sealer. A tool that binds one's will, leaving them open to manipulation. Given its inhumane nature, the use of such an artifact was supposedly banned. Ugh, if those buttheads are using something like that, then they're worse than trash! Hmm. Couldn't we just smash the cursed thing to pieces? I don't advise using force to break it. That would put Lyria's life in danger. Eh, I figured it wouldn't be that easy. What about nullifying its influence? I have a connection in Seed Hollow who knows his curios. I bet he could tell us more. You intend to ask the family Zothba? Informants don't cooperate without a price. Hey, deep down he's got a heart of gold. It'll work out. Wishful thinking. Thanks again, Roland. We'd be up the creek without you. Always glad to help. Remember, when Mr. Fixit's on the case, nothing is impossible. Haha, <laughs> got that right. Fixing our airship while it's stuck on a freezing mountain? Wow. Alas, I merely applied bandages. What she really needs is servicing in Seed Hollow. And on that note, I say we take to the skies. I'll show you the way. I'm as worried about Lyria as anyone, but this ship needs a serious tune-up. We finally caught up to Lyria, but her eyes had lost their spark. When I called her name, she didn't respond. She didn't hear me. The Lyria we know and love? It's like she wasn't in there anymore. What is Avia plotting? With so many mysteries left unsolved, I get the feeling this is just the beginning. But for now, we need to dig up info on this mind sealer thing. We flew through the night without ever stopping. I can see our next island, hugged by dawn's warming light. Call that amber glow false hope, but I'll take it.
Welcome. This is Sega Grande Skydom's largest city, Seed Hollow. Hmm? <sighs> Whew. Good news is the Grand Cipher's gonna be okay. She's in good hands. Luckily, the ship escaped severe damage. Should be a quick fix. Sorry to keep piling stuff on you. Appreciate it, buddy. So about this family Zotba or whatever, you know where to find them? I sure do. Their boss supposedly operates in this district. Information brokers don't exactly advertise to the public. He runs a bar as a front. Sounds like you've got his stuff together. I guess you'll find out for yourself when you meet him. Follow me. Let's start by heading to the main square. The bar should be in a back alley somewhere. Huh. Guess that's one way to design a ship. Always cool to see how other places build their rides. Wait till you visit the other districts. I'd love to give a grand tour, but... No biggie. Besides, sightseeing will be a lot more fun when Sleary is back with us. Very true. I'd better start brushing up on my tour guide skills. Of course, Seed Hollow wouldn't be complete without a blacksmith and a lion's rep. If you need to use their services, now's the time. You've got all kinds of flowers here. No wonder the city smells so good. I guess that's where the seed in Seed Hollow comes from. Man, this sucks. <laughs> totally. So much freaking work to do. Hmm? Say, uh, don't you two work for Zothba? Who's asking? Ah, snap, it's rolling. Where you been hiding, man? Thanks for always looking out for the boss. No, no, quite the opposite. Zothba has always been the one bailing me out. That info on Avia was spot on. <clears throat> But enough about that. It looks like you gentlemen are in a bit of a pickle. A pickle? Nah, man. We're swamped with work right now. Everyone in the family's fully booked. So, if you got biz with the boss, could you maybe go chill and come back later? Huh. I get you're busy, but we're also on the clock here. So, what I'm hearing is, once these errands of yours are cleared out, that'll open up Zothba's schedule. Is that right? More or less. Not like our mountain of work is gonna get smaller anytime soon, though. Got it. Captain, what do you say to lending these fine fellows a hand? I'm in. Me too! Beat sitting around all day. There you go. Meet your newest co-workers. And not just any co-workers. These Skyfarers have an impressive resume. For real? Awesome. Thanks. We appreciate it. And for starters, you think you could check in with a buddy of ours? He should be at the market. It's locked! No fair! <laughs> we probably should have made an appointment. Oh well, we'll make it work. Yo, I got the word. Ready to roll up your sleeves? Here's the deal. Some bigwig lost something in the city. Something really dangerous. I, uh, can't handle it myself without my legs turning to jelly. Talk with an alliance rep. I, uh, left the details with them.
Judging from your gear, are you perhaps Skyfarers? Welcome! This is Rafal's Seed Hollow Branch. Let's see. for something dangerous? Oh, you must mean that. Mm, yeah. I know a few folks that might be able to help you out. I'll write down what they look like. Go see what they have to say. looking for a dangerous thing? Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I guess you could call it dangerous. Try looking in places with shade, but be careful. Never know what might jump out at you. Wait, so the thing is alive? Ugh, this is making my beard bristle. Looking for something a magnet lost. Uh, that could only be one thing. Yep, no doubt about it. If it's what I think it is, you'll find it in an alley. Why can't you just tell us what it is? Oh, whatever. Let's move on to the next person. have anointed me as their beacon. Raise your eyes to the blue. That which you seek may come from above. These are eyes to the blue? Um, what are you talking about? Look in the shade. Above our heads. Down an alley? Is that what they're telling us? Maybe. Guess it's time to start crawling the back streets of Seed Hollow. dangerous thing we've been looking for. It's just a cat. Jeez, how dangerous can it be? Come on, let's get it home. The client is over the moon. <laughs> Glad that's over with. You could have just told us you can't stand cats. <laughs> when I was a kid, I got scratched by one. It left a scar on my body and my psyche. Ah, but you don't want to hear about that. Thanks again. Can't believe we went on a wild cat chase. Why would the family Zafba bother with boring jobs? I believe being a good information broker means having a finger in every pie, so to speak. In any case, we're making good progress. On to the next task. <laughs> Sorry. It'll lend a hand? Couldn't have come at a better time. We're assessing the castle's manpower, but it's not like the gods will volunteer to take a survey. I hate to use the term eavesdrop, but we're short on ears. If you see any castle guards, could you listen in? Out of sight and without getting caught, obviously. Greetings, Skyfarers. Welcome to Seed Hollow. Ah, Jesus! 
But where can we eavesdrop without being noticed? Can't decide, huh? <laughs> Don't worry, there are no wrong choices here. Let's camp out here. So my granddad said the craziest thing the other day. Well, don't leave me hanging. You know the Corridor of Peace? Know why they really call it that? No, why? It's to honor an astral who once saved us sky dwellers. <laughs> That's a good one. What a joke. That's what I said. They were the ones who conquered us. A compassionate astral. <laughs> Can you imagine? Now that story I'd like to hear more about. Unfortunately, it has nothing to do with our task. Remember, keep it. Who up. are you people? There's nothing to see here. Uh oh. Zathba's subordinate was right. We have to stay out of this sight. This spot looks good for spying. Shh. Heard the news? Yeah. They raised the threat level for the Skydom. They keep sending reinforcements to Tempeel and other islands. Castle defenses will be stretched thin. It's taking a toll on the public safety team, too. The Church of Avia has been popping up everywhere. At least we're safe here. Don't have to worry about Seed Hollow getting invaded. Just hope I don't get shipped out. Mobilizing soldiers out of Seed Hollow is sapping the castle's defenses. People might get edgy if this leaks. Remember! What are you staring at? Uh, nothing. Sneaky does it now. You think we can hide here? I know what I saw. That Harvin was wearing white robes. Match what was described in the intel report to a T. They say that uniform stole out to one of the deadliest groups in Avia. Obviously, the Silver Wolf Corps is also nothing to sneeze at. But this group uses strange techniques. Ugh, I should have arrested that Harvin. What if they've already infiltrated the city? Avia may have already infiltrated Seed Hollow? That's bad news. But good to know. I think we've heard enough. Let's go report this in. Paxto's tune? How'd it go? I see. I guess we'd better offer some resources to bolster the castle's defenses. By the way, didn't you say something about needing to see the boss? He should be in by now. Why don't you head for the bar? This Zosma guy sure likes to dip his talents in everything, huh? Yes. Thanks to him and his informants, the city's managed to stay relatively peaceful. But I'm going to do him one better and protect every single dweller in these skies. Really? Are you sure you're not biting off more than you can chew? Ugh, was that too much? Anyway, time to hit the bar. It's finally time to meet the legend himself. From what I've seen with his underlings, he runs a tight ship. Everyone, meet Zothba. Some jam. Yeah, I was hoping you could help. Let's talk business. You didn't let me finish. We aren't a charity. Selling info is how we don't starve. 
And the juicier the intel, the tastier our meals. You want a seat at the table? You gotta bring the bread. Know what I'm saying? Loud and clear. And you folks don't strike me as the type that can afford our prices. I'll say. Those hefty ship repair bills add up pretty darn fast. How about a proposal? You scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. We really don't have time for this. Don't pass on a deal till you've heard every last detail. We've already looked into the mind sealer around your friend's neck. A catalyst stone that'll cancel the magic sleeps in some ruins on Dolly Island. Are you absolutely certain? Let me guess. You're giving us the scoop because you want something in return. Man knows how to cut to the chase. All you resourceful folks have to do is break the seal on those ruins. It just so happens there's hidden treasure in there we'd love to get our hands on. And those are the conditions. Not a bad deal, if you ask me. Yep, we both get what we want. Seems fair enough. At this point, I think any lead is worth investigating. The choice is yours, Captain. I'll be waiting at the port. Come see me when you've got your answer. Mr. Shade back there was no ordinary dude. Thank you. Right. I think you painted a different picture of the guy, Roland. <laughs> uh, well, he's... Very passionate about his work, yes. We didn't come here to dig up treasure for someone else. I know it's not the most direct way to get to Lyria, but it's better than nothing. Why did it have to be Dolly Island, though? Hi, everyone! I dared good tidings. Alpha wanted to thank you for your hard work. Something about finding hot gossip and shady cats? High fairing work sure is something else. Enjoy your gift! Can't find what you like? <laughs> I love the barter! What can I trade you for? Your patronage is always a plus. The fruit in the market looks so good! Too bad it'll have to wait for another day. Yeah. Who knows when we'll find the time to kick back and relax. I'm sure Lyria will fall in love with this beautiful city. It's gonna be great showing her around. I don't got all day. Are we doing this or not? Pleasure working with you. Good. Neither of us wants a fine business opportunity to slip through our fingers. <laughs> um, hey, this is out of the blue, but I might have some personal things to tend to. Oh, say what? You're gonna flake on us? Uh, while you check the ruins, I'll look for the red ship. It'll be more efficient. I appreciate the thought, but should you go after them alone? There's no need to worry about me. I promise. I always finish what I start. <sighs> Thank you, Roland. We owe you so much. Take care of them, Zathba. Are you telling me how to do my job? Who's wearing the informant pants here? Oh, <laughs> you, you got me there. What was I thinking? Oh, but at least take this. Well, well. A transceiver. I made it with my own two hands. I'd like it back when this is over. 
Better hope it doesn't fall apart on me then. Now, as a small bonus, our family's pride and joy will fly you to Dolly in style. Be careful out there, everyone. Found some. Sweet. <laughs> okay. Oh, before you ask, this ride's free. Make it worth my while, Skyfarers. Dolly Island. That's where we're going to find the Catalyst Stone to free Lyria from the Mind Sealer. This is our last thread of hope, and nothing's gonna make us let go. Not even a waking nightmare. It's okay. Come, the stars await, and we mustn't keep them. You were tossing. Do you feel all right? And how are you feeling? I feel fine. Why ask me such a question? I... <gasps> I found it. Another god. As we fly closer to the main island, an ocean of sand seems to stretch on forever. Large ruins break the surface like icebergs. It's time to start digging through the past, because in one of those tombs lies the catalyst to our future. That mind sealer thing pisses me off. The sooner we find the catalyst, the better. I just started Toy Storm! Uh, almost took a spill there. Actually, surfing down dunes might save us time. Just don't wipe out and eat sand. Uh-oh. Uh Is that a pack of wolves? Trail looks promising. I once read that treasure's always buried off the beaten path. Okay. Now, I'll you will prevail. Fighting in Zega Grande ain't so different, is it? How so? I don't think there's anything here. On second thought, do we even know what the catalyst looks like? Seals Dothba was talking about? 
They may be around here. Ah, nice and cool. A little shade makes all the difference. When was this structure built? Okay. Despite the wear and tear, it doesn't seem that old to me. Probably has a complicated history, like every other tomb with buried treasure. Hmm. Hello there. What's this? I'd have flown to a goose day. There's no way to stop sliding. Just try to maintain your balance. <laughs> I see you found the golden carpet. The desert rolls out for its death. <laughs> Enjoy the slide. What does that mean? Did you set a trap for us? What would I gain from that? Don't worry. You'll be fine. Uh, you're the last person I trust. Trust or not, all we can do is slide. We're just going to have to play it by ear. The floor gave out, and you know it. Uh, whatever the circumstances, it saved you time. And that's worth celebrating. Good business is all about efficiency. I mean, you're not wrong. We need as much time as we can get. Are we still going the right way? Yep. Up ahead, you'll see something that looks like a door. Huh? What's that glowy thing on the floor? That's the key to moving forward. Stand on it for a bit and watch the ruins come alive. Is this the light of a primal? What kind of place have we wandered into? Well, I'll be. The door's opening. Holy moly! This place is way bigger than I thought! See that platform smack dab in the middle of the desert? You gotta light the whole thing up. The contraption you're after is probably sleeping soundly beneath it. After you break the seal, we'll be collecting our treasure. Sound simple enough? Yes, in theory. But we all know these sorts of places are riddled with traps. Nothing's free in life. You want the catalyst? You gotta work for it. Skyfarer's job never ends. Keep one hand on your weapon at all times. Hey, it'd be boring if all we did was step on tiles. Let's start by exploring up ahead. Ah. What just happened? What peculiar wind matter? Perhaps this mechanism was used as a form of transportation? That ought to make desert surfing a breeze. So we need to make this whole circle blow, huh? You got it. It's basically a trap door to the vault. Once you activate all the keys, the door will unlock. And that sweet, sweet treasure will be mine. Uh, you mean there's more than one key? Yep. Remember the first one you stepped on? Just do that a few more times. And they're scattered throughout this whole desert. At least our sight lines are clear. Should be easy enough to spot them. Building, no doubt. All that beauty lost forever. It just breaks my heart. 
Okay, that's a golem. Or this Skydom's version of one. I wonder if they imported the technology from Earth Day. Was it guarding something? Now then! Please don't move. Please don't move. We managed to pull through. If we use the terrain wisely, 
quickly. We can split them off into smaller groups. Beat them down. Rain. I got you covered. I think we got away somehow. Avoid needless battles and live to fight another day. Did this used to be a tower? Probably. And judging from the look of these ruins... Hold on. Something's coming. Would you call it big bone or shredded? Eh, who cares? Let's just blow the damn thing up. Here's a little paper. <laughs> Looking good. Finish! Ah. 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 Make it me look bad. Ah. You oh reap what you sow. <laughs> it's gonna take a lot more to take us down. Here they come! Let's move this carefully! How about no? Trying to activate the key while digging it out? <laughs> I'm impressed. It's called killing two birds with one stone. Whether we pull it off is a different story. Here's a little payback. It's over. Keep it. 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 Move it on the front of the floor! Press the attack! Beat. I've got an axe to grind with this one. No bones about. No comment. Tempest, I'm right here. Tempest, play! Catalina, I'll protect you! Fall down! You reap what you sow! Gil! I'm on it! You like that? Bring it! The astrophysic! <laughs> now that's a team it again. Gotta be right. Look out for any large attacks. How about no? What you sow. That gun is my biscuit. How about Cover me! Cover it! Ugh, that thing gave me the willies. Credit where credit's due. It was no lazy bones. Sigh. You done clearing out moots? Then hightail it over to the key. Halfway there! Keep standing on that switch! Attacks are our best bet against that flying beast. Rain! 
I won't let you down. It's here. Weapons out. Just like hunting ducks. Big old angry ducks. You reap what you sow. Last move. Here goes. Got him. Get him all at once. Got it. On guard. Leash is off now. It's about to get ugly. Let's stay cautious. Here's a little payback. This war's not over yet. How about no? to activate the key. and grab the loot. I've got a date with that treasure chest. Now for the moment of truth. That catalyst better be there. Should be sitting pretty on its own tailor-made pedestal. I don't care what you grab first. Just don't forget to bring us back our box of riches. Yeah. <laughs> 
these punks again. If you want a beating, we'll oblige. You took the words right from my mouth. Oh, who said that? That stone is a captivating prize. Unfortunately, I can't allow you to claim it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you may call me Magliel, and these are my kindred. to show you our beautiful blade work. Do enjoy yourselves to the fullest. Teach them a lesson they shall never forget. With pleasure. Failed, my lady. <sighs> oh, very well. Since you insist upon testing the sword veil. Remember, no defense is flawless.
will reap what you sow. It's Roland. Is the Grand Cipher back to 100%? Yes. We're on our way over right now. You're getting it done. Thanks, pal. So, any news on the Catalyst? We sort of ran into a minor hiccup, but it's safe in our hands now. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Great <laughs> job out there, everyone. I'm coming to pick you up now. Thanks. Wait. Roger. I won't fail! <laughs> Stay scenario together. This is Doomstock, requesting backup. We've got to save Pops and the others. Roger that. The Divine Guardian must have leave this island. It is imperative that you have to find him. Destroy the Red Reactor's power in each section. I believe that will limit its function. Nailed it. Sounds like you knew more than you let off, Roland. Why didn't you tell me about this thing? It should have been impossible to activate under normal circumstances. It really isn't the best time. Yeah. That's you all I'm getting for now. Know. Once the dust settles, you and me are gonna have to chat. Anywho, the reactors are its weak spots, right? Let's get closer without getting crushed. The protective armor has been destroyed. Those have got to be the red reactors. Get in there and smash them. Here's a little payment. Never please. Hear me. Oh, crash land 
landed in a valley to the northwest. <laughs> Lots of injured crew. <laughs> Got it. Sit tight. We'll pick you up when we can. <laughs> What's up? Lots of thing expels some kind of exhaust when it moves. Now I know what an ant feels like. Move in, colony. We're bringing this Titan down. Look out, everyone! A powerful attack is coming! Get ready to avoid it! about this subject, doesn't he?
the greatest pilot ever! Oh, great. And Buck has blasted the ground around his feet. Pull back, all of you! How'd it go up there? Excavalion won't go without a fight. It's protecting itself with a sand barrier. That flawless defense. They don't call it the primeval god of fortification for nothing. Dude, why are you phrasing that thing? If we don't do something, it'll get back on its feet. I know. We can climb up his arm to get onto its back. And once we're up there, we'll have more options. Sounds like a plan to me. Come on. It's time to climb Mount Huntley. Since we're kind of in a deadlock right now, with it, I have visual confirmation. You're almost to the top. I think I see it. <laughs> no, wait!
Medallion will crumble. The second one is down. Keep going. Eva, back in the game. That's the last cylinder. The barrier should be down. Nice. We got this in the back. Don't take your guard down. I can't smoke the drink on the corner. You're safe, Vern. And the catalyst? Do you still have it with you? Got it right here! Thank goodness. And all that's left is to rescue Lyria from Avia. Yeah! There's still one problem, though. How do we find Lyria when we don't even know where to look? I've got that covered. I discovered where the red ship is going. Whoa! Did you really? Mm-hmm. Yes, really. They're heading to a place called Fondem, the Scarred Isles. Magma flows deep beneath the land. Not exactly what I'd call an ideal vacation spot. It almost sounds like a volcano. Why would they go there? I'll explain on the ship. Come, back to the Grand Cypher. Hey, folks. Sorry to butt in. Me and the boys are gonna park ourselves right here. If you come across any curios while you're out there, come see us again. We'll trade you some great items for them. Hope you give us the VIP treatment. Uh, you got cheap, don't you? I can appreciate the hustle. Hmm. You folks are tough, but if you really need me, just call. I'll come around. In the meantime, try not to kick the bucket. Got it? Hmm. Looks handy. Just a matter of time before we get our Lyria back. With the catalyst in our hands, we board the Grand Cipher to go after Avia again. Next stop is Fondum. Just a short hop step and a flight away. It's been roped off as a danger zone, which, yeah, isn't ominous at all. The church is headed there for one thing. Yet another altar housing a primeval god. All of Zega Grande's gods, or I guess primal beasts, are a force to reckon with. But we can't let Avia keep exploiting Lyria's power. If they force her to commit atrocities, once this is all over, she'll never forgive herself.
thick black smoke blankets the sky. Rivers of fire flow below. Yeah, pretty much the perfect stage for a fateful showdown. Well, here's to hoping we make it out in one piece. There, we're moored. Red ships shouldn't see us from here. We'll hit them before they know what's coming. I'm not the only one who saw that big-ass fire geyser, right? No, we all saw it. Only a primal could pull that off. Then it's clear that's where they've taken Lyria. Prepare for take... <laughs> what now? I believe it means the volcano is close to erupting. How are you so calm? Lava is not how I want to go out. And what about the Grand Cipher? But we have to get to Lyria. You're preaching to the choir. Of course I want to go rescue her, but I just... Ugh. I saw how they handled Excavalion. It could be my best bet going forward. But we'll be stranded here if we lose the ship. It would all be for nothing. All right. I'll take the helm and fly the ship to safety. Once the area stabilizes, I'll come back to pick you guys up. You all go on ahead. Sorry for the trouble, Roland. Sure you don't mind? Not at all. Besides, since when has Mr. Fixit ever let you down? Ah, before I go. Vern, do you mind showing me the catalyst? Wait, right now? Um, sure. No problem. There, I've activated it. Hold it near Lyria, and it should release the lock on the collar. And that'll give us a fighting chance! Thanks, Fix-It, dude! Hmm... Time to part ways for now. Danger lurks around every corner in this place, so proceed with caution. Don't worry about us. You just focus on keeping the Grand Cipher safe. Come on, everyone. We need to hurry. I'm sorry, Skyfarers. Lilith was my responsibility. Everyone good? I need you all to be ready to kick some tail. Goodbye, world. No one survived in that. Hey, you guys notice anything different about Roland? Not really. I mean, I guess he seems kind of tired. He's helped us out of more jams than I can count. Let's get him something nice once this... My cousin was lost Okay. Hello there. I can feel it. A primal beast is nearby. Watch her slip away. Why is he fighting that primal beast? 
Your guess is as good as mine. All I know is he's the reason Lyria's here in the first place. Volcano's getting ready to blow! Oh no! The ground is sinking into the magma! Can't do anything about it! Just run for your lives! Don't look back! Soon, right? That primal looks quite similar to Bahamut. Is that why it was able to imprison Lyria? Why is it taking a dip in the magma? Oh, the yikes! It's a magma wave! Get swallowed by that, and it'll eat more than a nasty bird! Get to the cover of that outcropping! It's our only chance! Now's our chance to cross the gap! Wave in half? I don't know whether to be grateful or terrified. Both, I guess. That's our cue! Keep it up, guys! Why is he going that far? Could he really be trying to save Lyria? I mean, even if he does, he'll just take her away again, and we're back to square one. My thoughts exactly. Can't let him do that. It looks like they've come to an impasse. Now we can join the fight. Another wave is coming! Still got it. You can run, but you can't hide. Not why we're on the hunt. Hold on, Maria. Why are you here? Like Do you that. even care about her? I already told you. I have. Oh, no. yes. Encounter will be its last. We're waiting, everyone. You know it. I'm going to 
going to give Lyria the wake up call of her life. this god, you'll need my help. All right. We'll work with you, you as long as our goals are long. I'll join forces for now. Let's get that primal. Now then, there's a blow again. Means our attack won't get through. Let's do what we did before. After we create an opening, you use the catalyst. Done. I'll be ready. Got a beat up. Taking us all out in a blaze of glory? But look, its movements have flowed. We still have a 
Volcanic activity is attuned to the beast. Has that managed to stop it? Man is still flowing out of other parts of its body. We should split up to save time. How about no? Get blasted! You saved my bacon. Gotta beat that. Only one left. The last one. The ball of fire dissipated. Catastrophe averted. Muhammad saved me. You barely stopped that ticking time bomb.
it. Oh, what a pity. Grief and misery make fools of us all. Here I see a troop of puppets flouncing about in a play with no audience. And your bond with the shaman? It's threadbare. Little more than a thin line of hope. Fear not, and trust me with your strings, and I shall deliver salvation unto you all. I know this is much too sudden for you to comprehend. But don't struggle. Embrace it. Go on. Embrace my love. He of nice of obvious leader will come to meet us himself. Saved up the trouble of tracking you down. You my dear, you I'm not looking for a fight. I've come to extol the virtue of salvation. you reject salvation do you not see that it is the perfect course you dare defy me to the end I'd rather not harm you that would not be in the shaman's best interest so I ask, judge for yourself the miracle of my salvation. Ah! Huh? That's dirty! Give it back! Why? This has always belonged to us. I admit, I am intrigued as to how you were able to activate the Catalyst. Although, I suppose it no longer matters at this point. With the Primals in my possession, I've won. how to make a strong cage. My powers are useless against it. Damn it! We didn't come this far to get put in time out! There is still hope left. He did. And now even Vulcan Bola has fallen into Lilith's hands. I can't stall any longer. 
The fate of the skies calls upon the might of your crew. Will you fight to save it? Roland, I'm not sure if I like where this is going. Yeah. Tell us what this is all about. Of course. But first, your injuries need tending to. Let's return to the ship. <sighs> the time to reveal the truth has come. Well, the floor is all yours, Roland. Thanks. First, I want you all to take a look at this. That's the beast from Tempeel. Furikin. Lilith released the primal beasts from their slumber and stole their powers. Those powers now flow within Lyria. She's essentially a living storage vessel. <laughs> the Astral Realm is Lilith's home. One way back is to restore the Forbidden Primal. Angra Mainyo. I hope I'm wrong, but she plans to feed it the other beast's powers. Just how big and nasty is this Mainyo thing? It's the primal beast of gateways, allowing all kinds of travel between any two points. Distance doesn't matter, so in theory, one could even pass through to the Astral Realm. Doesn't sound that evil to me if all it does is open a bunch of doors. <sighs> if only it were that innocent. The problem lies in what's needed to open a gate. You see, the gates require energy proportional to the distance between them. Now, let's pretend we want to open a gate to the Astral Realm. In this case, distance is secondary. Now we're discussing interdimensional travel. So, energy-wise... Yes. An extraordinary amount will need to be consumed. And that instantaneous consumption will trigger grave repercussions. At best, Zega Grande would be reduced to nothing in the aftershock. At worst, most of the Sky Realm would cease to exist as we know it. There's no way that's possible! Then let me tell you a story. Fifteen years ago, Lilith revived Angra Mainyo. She attempted to open the gate to the Astral Realm. Fortunately, for whatever reason, she failed in her scheme. But a number of islands weren't so lucky, and they were rendered uninhabitable. Survivors of the incident are forever cursed to live their lives with unending trauma. That's awful! You see now? She won't give up. She will utilize the power of the Four Primals, and attempt to cast open the gates once more. And the only thing waiting for us on the other side of those gates is sheer destruction. We can't allow history to repeat itself. There's something I'd like to ask about this woman, this Lilith. She's an astral, isn't she? The potency of her powers and her obsession with the Astral Realm give her away. <sighs> the Astrals. The invaders who once ruled over our skies. You are correct. Mm-hmm. Well... It takes one to know one. <gasps> Unbelievable. I suspected as much a while back. You knew a great deal about this Skydom, things that no ordinary person should know. I'll be damned. Real live astral right under our noses. <laughs> 
Sorry. Can't blame a guy for being on edge. Those are obvious raptors! You're kidding! They really chased after us? They couldn't have mobilized a hunting party this quickly. Of all the times to hound us, they choose now? Well, they're here. Less talking, more blasting! at the end of this flight path. Which means we're headed to the same place as these jokesters. Indeed. And let us discuss particulars after we have saved our hides. These kids don't know when to give up. It seems conviction is a strong motivator. Oh, well, you've got an asshole you have yet, Jane. Now let's really bring the pain. <laughs> You will prevail. I love when a plan comes together. I guess so. Finally, that was the last of them. Looks like Obvious already making their next move. I must take action. Wait, I just want to be super sure. Are you really an astral? <laughs> You wouldn't be the first. We've met other Astrals before. Loki and Mikaboshi, if those names ring a bell. They have their own particular philosophies. But you seem different from them. I know, right? It's like Fixit Dude actually wants to be a part of the Sky Realm. Indeed. It was no act when you risked life and limb to save the people of Folka and Tempil. I'll be honest. I once viewed Sky Dwellers as insignificant, but that all changed. Many years ago, the first friend I ever made in this world taught me a valuable lesson. They said there is strength in solidarity. Understanding can overcome adversity. Help us grow. Volka is now my home away from home. The people there are like family to me. Sadly, we experience longevity on different scales. If I were granted one wish, it'd be to stay with them forever. At the very least, I want them to be happy. I'll do anything I can as an astral to protect the populace, to protect the islands, and I'll stop Lilith, no matter the consequences I must suffer. We understand how you feel. The Sky Realm is our home, too. So you can count on us. I guess even Astros come in all kinds of different flavors, just like Sky Dwellers. The same can be said of primal beasts. <laughs> Kinda weird having an astral watching our backs for once. But I won't complain. Thanks, everyone. I'm sorry I haven't been up front with you all. I suppose I was acting out of cowardice. I was... afraid of your reactions, if you learned I was an astral. We're in this together. <laughs> Captain, thank you. <laughs> done and done. Yes, with Roland's aid, we'll surely stop Lilith and rescue Lyria. Angramanyu's real body is in an altar beneath Seed Hollow Castle. Yikes, 
There's a sinister primal lurking right under that huge city? Yes. And I'm the one who sealed it down there centuries ago. But if Lilith found Angra 15 years ago, that means the seal is... Broken. When she squandered away Angra's power, she failed to capture its true form as well. I'm certain it's still in the altar somewhere, camouflaged by its gateway powers. Uh, so that's why you stayed behind in Seed Hollow, to find the damn thing. Indeed. Unfortunately, my search turned up nothing. However, the moment Lilith summons Angra's real body, that may be our chance to strike. I warn you, she and I are equally matched. But, lucky for me, I've got the better team. Apia's no doubt getting closer to the castle. There's no time to lose. We'll gear up in the city and make a run for the altar. Or else these skies are done for. Really hitting the fan now, huh? You better hightail it back to Seed Hollow before it's too late. So, we've suddenly found ourselves caught up in an astral tug of war, decades in the making. The relationship between Lilith and Roland remains unclear. But one thing is certain Roland is our greatest ally in Zega Grande. And with all the good he's done here, his love for Sky Dwellers is plain as day. Together, I know we'll stop Lilith, and ensure Angra Mainyu's gate stays closed. We will protect the Sky Realm. Seed Hollow is burning. Another victim in Avia's desperate mission to return to the stars. This all started because I brought Lyria to Zeka Grande. And now our battle is intertwined with the fate of the Sky Realm itself. We need to get to the heart of the city and fix the damage that's been done. Whoa! Is this even the same city? No time to assess casualties, I'm afraid. Not when we know Avia will make a beeline for the castle. Oh, you back already? Look, you've scratched my back in the past, so I'm willing to give part with some intel, free of charge. Regarding the city, my people are out surveying the damage as we speak. Early reports suggest, strangely enough, that Avia isn't focused on taking out the commercial district. Instead, they're concentrating on one area and one area alone. The castle. Considering they've got a force of 5,000 strong, you'd think they'd try to occupy more. But here we are. In addition to the ground troops, they've got manned and unmanned aircraft to boot. Not to mention, the Silver Wolf Corps and the Sword Veil vale seem to be acting in concert. First time for everything, huh? To be completely honest, the whole thing makes me mad as hell. I'd like to jump into this circus and pound a few chumps myself. The city's well-being comes first. You just go smack their leader a good one for me. Got it? We'll all sleep better once she's out of commission. Avia is focused entirely on occupying Seed Hollow Castle. I fear Lilith is wasting no time. She's not sparing numbers either. Thanks for the assistance. I would never abandon one of Zega Grande's most vital trading hubs. It's not in my nature to watch a crisis unfold from the sidelines. By the way, Captain... I don't know if you've heard, but the castle is under attack by the Church of Avia. That 
forced each of the city's wards to declare temporary lockdowns. I'll be around until the brouhaha settles down. Give me a holler if you need anything. We can't let Avia get away with all they've done. Take this, and go show them who's boss. The church's attack has shut this whole city down. Talk about dire straits. At least Ciro still has her shop open. That's kind of a relief, right? Once she hears coins jingling, I'm not sure Bahamut himself could stop her. Anyway, let's double check our supplies before moving on. We'll enter the castle through these doors. Everyone ready? Ready. This time, I'm coming too. We'll save Lyria. And stop Lilith once and for all. Undercroft should be just down this corridor. Man, those poor seed hollow guards. They didn't sign up for this. Huh? Ah, we found trouble! I thought we cleared out this area. Get out of here, or face this You people have gone too far. You're not gonna Andra Mainize our Lyria, you hear me? Don't back down. We have the power of the primeval gods on our side. Primeval gods, huh? It's amazing how that term persists. Six hundred years after I first formed I, Lyria and I were working on our experiment. Suddenly, the effects of Skyfall are emotions. Such as faith on primal beasts. She twisted the conviction of the masses. You reap what you sow. Building blocks with this paramilitaristic cult. Lady Lilith to guide us to the promised land. We do not fear death. Inquisitor Rook's troop will be here soon. Hold on till then. The church finds you in defiance of Our Lady's grand message. Face your penance! Now we have to deal with full-on battleships? This is not in my job description. We don't have time to repel all of them. Stopping Lilith comes first. Wait, Roland. Weren't you the one who sealed Angra Mine you? Indeed. 500 years ago. You couldn't find a better location? For Sky's sake, putting a primal like that under a damn metropolis. Forgive me. It was the height of the war, and I needed a place inaccessible to an astral like Lilith. So you chose an enemy stronghold. Not exactly a conventional plan, but effective nonetheless. How dare you take these lies about Lady Lilith's astral origin? No! You will learn to stay your tongue, interlopers! You have my own. Oh, now let's get out of here! Bring in the sure. Send me a postcard. Your time's up now, huh? Into the fray! Cover it! That is good! The power of the Astros. I'll use it to defend these skies. You reap what you sow! Right behind you! you Finally brought through them. Onward and downward? These soldiers are not to blame for Lilith's machinations. And yet they're the ones paying the ultimate price. A little debris won't stop us. Allow me. Fine, so you can clear rubble. Think you can clean an airship? What's the pay like? Shall we talk price? Quickly! The Undercroft should be close. Sure. 
birds do not play fair. We can take refuge in the cellars below. There's no way their fusillade will reach us down there. I just hope they stop firing completely. This castle's too pretty to be destroyed. Gonna take half a miracle to bring down that carrier. So do we run, or...? <sighs> Judging from the position of oh. this tower, the terrace leading to the court should be close. Face the interlopers who routed Rook and his men! A Lady Lilith! Yeah, a Lady Lilith! Normally I like devotion in my mercs, but you punks take it too far! You foul interlopers! We will not let you stand in the way of our glorious victory! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Don't you know what Lilith is planning to do? How dare you question our lady! You will die for the salvation! No! You're wrong! She would swallow this whole sky up to see her selfish ambition fulfilled! You included! Just as... Just as she did 15 years ago in Dolly! You will to do my hand. It will not work! You will pay for making a mockery of Lady Lilith! They would die before doubting Lilith? She has been utterly bewitched. Maybe now's not the best time for conversion. Let's save the deep brainwashing till after the fighting, shall we? You promised these Sky Dwellers salvation while ushering them toward doom. Lilith, you are a Here's fiend. A little payback. <laughs> Thanks. You like that?
love it. Destroy such a fine specimen. Hold on, you hear that humming? I don't think we're out of the woods yet. Now we have to fight two of them? Allow me! Uh, don't mind if I recruit a little help? Or seems undamaged. I could use it to fight off the others. Did you really just hop out on that thing? Yeah, you even sure. analyze it? Where we're going, we have no need for lightning physics. It'll be a cinch to cover you. Why does Forward always get weirder around new machines? Yeah, I don't like that twinkle in his eye. No, 
Oh, come now. Why must you criticize me mid-battle? Can't we focus? Prepare our cannons. We have to give our reinforcements by you and our time to come online. Is it? Never fear. I'll have it removed post haste. <laughs> now, there should be an entrance to the undercroft from the front of the court. to die for. There's no better appetizer to a banquet of blood. I knew you'd be back for more. In the name of the Sword Veil Fellowship, I shan't let you take another step. Let's have a clean... Death match! How about an ass kicking for dessert? Ah, if we have a piece, a death match. You like that? The obvious who's wrong this general. As you can see, my boy is in need of some entertainment. Not here's a fun trick. You reap what you sow. Madness can stone you! They're attacking in tandem! Blinking together with your partner trip, was it not? I think we've rather perfected it! Yes! Legends will be told of the mighty Galanta Extravaganza! Excuse me, though, what? I deserve credit too! You reap what you do in a high! Oh, yeah! Your time's up! Captain! I'm right here! 
I know well the lunacy of my position to be making demands of you. But please, the Sard Vale are my family. If you can, find it in your heart to spare them. Take me! I staked my life on this death match. Now come claim your hard-earned spoils. Uh, look, we just want to get through here without trouble. As long as you stay out of our way, we got no reason to fight anymore, deal? There's no time to waste. Forgive my failure, Lady Lilith. Complete and utter defeat! They might actually pull it off! They were masters of their respective arts. Why do they follow Lilith? Even great warriors may find themselves prey to hard times. Salvation, no matter how false, seems an alluring prize. And, well, some astrals have a certain charm, which can prove intoxicating to many skyfarers. They've got all the nasty tricks. But what about Lilith's son? He an astral it too? It seems we've reached a dead end. Let's Not see. to worry. There's another path Close this way. There. Here we are. Would you all please stand back? Up ahead is the altar where Angra Mindy lies sealed. You will no doubt find Lilith there already. A special ward warps time and space around Angra, making physical contact impossible. Let us hope Lilith has not breached it yet. We have only one shot at victory. I will strike the moment she calls for Angra. So when it gets its fuel, blast the engine? Yep, that'll do it. Okay, people, look alive. This one. I hope these potions will be enough, okay? Oh no, is that... Lyria, let's move! so long. Finally, the dawning of salvation is upon us. The path will soon open. <gasps> oh. I wasn't expecting to see them again. That's enough! Lyria's coming back with us! Is that so? Id? Just focus on them. 
I've been waiting for you to return and cast open a gate. So I can destroy Angra Mainyu!
he... is he actually down? Let's just get to Lyria. were such a careless one. Get ready. <laughs> the primal beast who distorts space itself. I can't believe it overpowered Roland so easily. This fight's going to get desperate. Stay vigilant. You sky dwellers are autumn leaves, and I am the winter of your discontent. My coming is your death. Even if Reyes was no match for me, I could likely blow you over with a single breath. Why you accept it? You don't let me get away with your nasty schemes. Cut up your tooth and crush it. We'll finish up our emotional reunion later. First comes to meet these punks. Syria, burn. Stay back. Things are bound to get serious. Okay. Be careful, Catalina. Uh, I'm not much of a fighter. If I notice anything suspicious, I'll tell ya. I'm up! Hey, that's no fair! Off the map, you all see through, and then our attack stops working! I can sense that it's here and yet not. That must be part of its power. Oh, like a laugh to the slaughter. Captain, please protect Lyria at all costs. How about no? After me! What did you do? That's our bread you just took. If only you sky brothers had come to your senses, all of this could have been avoided. You are not worth the air you breathe. Still here. Return to the void. You reap what you sow. This can't be the end. Gotta beat up. You two? What is happening? No, not again. This is wrong. How do we stop her? You still think 
think you can stop me? What a quaint thought. I'm afraid your little crew is all out of options. Now, join your lost friends on the other side. No one gives a crap about your evil plans. Just give her friends back. Hear me? You like that? What is it with you now? Let's go with that. Dear Captain, you deserve to be rewarded above all others for bringing you the shock to my doorstep. Bear witness that your entire world crumbles. Should I see you in the next right. Yeehaw, Yeehaw. 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 It will be too soon. Not today! Don't worry about me, Captain! Just blast this sucker! little bird trapped by these skies let me whisk you away on a journey aboard the ark of angra mainyu other half. <laughs> Id, explain yourself. Mother, you told me to protect Lyria. But this... Why this? This isn't what you said! Why did Lyria... Calm yourself, Id. Angra Mainyu has been revived. Thus, the shaman's role is complete. Consequently, your duty as her guardian is no longer needed. But Mother... Please! Temper, Id. It almost sounds as if you disagree with me. My naughty child, you're no better than these interlopers. Forget about me! Focus on your link! may very well crumble. Adversity only seems to push you towards victory. After all, you must be confident you can prance out of here as the hero. Don't be. Humdrum tales of heroism and gallantry have no place on my shelf. Let us finish this charade!
Hmm? A shining blade, the sword of Eos. A lovely of Astraeus to leave you a parting gift. Wait! You cannot possibly now. mean to use it against Andra, mind you. <laughs> the nearest Sky Dweller should not have the Don't magical get. reserves to wield it. <laughs>
Primeval dragon. Child of darkness and flames. Thy name is... I think. What the hell happened? It appears the Captain and Lyria restored everything back to normal. Way to go, Captain! Man, it's hard keeping up with you young bucks. Always stealing the thunder. <laughs> well done, Captain. Aren't we missing someone? I think we can safely say, all's well that ends well. <laughs> <laughs> I want to apologize to everybody. Even though I couldn't control myself, I could still see everything that was happening. All the scary stuff I did, I was powerless to stop it. I wasn't sure if it was a dream. That wasn't you, Lyria. You all still came to save me. After what I did to everyone. To Catalina. And especially to you. It's okay now. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry.
Dry your tears, Lyria. You're back with us now. There's nothing to fear. Just use you as the fuel source, then. No, I won't let history repeat itself. Now I understand. You're all influenced by the singularity. But fate set in motion can't be stopped. You will come to understand the depths of my... Unflinching resolve. The astral realm awaits the fruits of my research. I won't be denied, Estelucia! Stop. If you open the gate to the astral realm, this world will be destroyed. Angra was sealed for a reason. Does that mean nothing to you? Let me ask you this instead. Why do you care so much about these skies? They're so full of heartache and despair. Worries that shall be long eclipsed by the providence of a new order. You're blind, Lilith. Blind to their kinship. Blind to their hopes and dreams. There are things in this world that be more than power or... Fix it, dude! <sighs> no, Astraeus. All that is obvious to me is that we don't see eye to eye. And you're as guilty of the same sins as the rest of these fools. from grief and sacrifice fulfill my salvation <laughs> to the astral realm. <laughs> Salvation follows at my heels. The sky will fall and the stars will ascend. Utopia is within my grasp. Seems so. Everybody, run! Look! 
I don't know. It just came out of nowhere. The end? Hurry! Go link up with Dagger's crew. Yes, sir. How's the second district holding up? I see him! Oh, no. The city's falling to pieces. Hey, I think we need to tell Zothba about Roland. got your friend back. Hello. Nice to meet you. My name is Lyria. I'm Zothba, an information broker. Must have been tough out there, huh, little lady? Um, yes. It was. Zothba, do not frighten the poor child. Huh? Who's being scary? I'm on my best behavior here. It pleases me to see that everyone is in good health. I came to lend my support the moment I caught wind of Avia's assault on Seed Hollow. Speaking of allies, I don't see Roland with you. Where'd he go? He's been captured. Ah, oh, crap. Well, look, don't get too down. He's not one to croak without a fight. Maybe we can do something for him, though. <laughs> you in, Histy? Most certainly. I am off to make arrangements at once. All right. Call it intuition, or an overactive gut. But an epic storm's brewing in this here skydom. Don't know how to explain it, but the air's buzzing with emotions. Stuff like joy, anxiety, sadness, anger. You can tell when it's coming to a head. <sighs> I haven't felt this spooked since the Dolly Island disaster 15 years ago. My point is, you folks ought to haul it back to your own Skydom. What? You can't say that at a time like this! Look, my sources tell me you hail from Fanta Grande. You've got a fine ship that can cross the Grim Basin. No need to play hero here. It's not like that! We can't just leave everyone when we know it's coming! Lilith is going to use something called the Pillar of Vayoi to destroy the sky! Do we just let her do it? And what about Roland? Let me be the voice of reason here. You saved your princess. Mission accomplished. So what do knights do after rescuing the damsel? They make sure she stays safe. You're an excellent captain, and so I don't need to spell out your next move for you, do I? We're gonna save Roland. I'm glad you're looking out for the man. But did you hear a single word I said? Come on. All I'm saying is don't push your luck. Ah, oh, who am I kidding? We both know I can't talk you out of this. But Zega Grande is our home. At least let us keep our pride. Be seeing you around then. And quit with the long faces. We can handle this. Okay. <laughs> Zega Grande, but... Roland made it abundantly clear that Angramainu is more than Zega Grande's problem. That power can and will consume the skies. Ah, 
Welcome back. The Grand Cipher's good to go. Are you ready to leave? Let's fly. The air currents have become unstable. Keep your wits about you. So, are we really doing this? What's the plan? We're going to rescue Roland. <laughs> right on! Mission numero uno! He's the reason we were able to save Lyria. Now it's our turn to repay the favor. And I gotta thank him for taking such good care of the Grand Cipher. I'm with you there. But this ain't gonna be a walk in the park, you know. <laughs> Bring it on. There's no turning back anyway. Hang tight, fix it, dude. We're a coming for ya. Let's give it everything we've got. A more fearless crew there never was. <laughs> Let us wish them well. They're the perfect folks to defy primeval gods. I'm kinda glad it's them, and not me. And so our debt to them grows heavier once more. Well, enough yammering. We got our own work to do. Wind's running wild today, but it's nothing the Grand Cypher can't handle. We finally have Lyria back, but there's not even time to celebrate. Lilith is so close to her goal, she's become blind to everything else. I doubt there's anything that can stop her now, except us. It might sound melodramatic, this is fate. Our crew versus Lilith. So there's only one thing left to do. Fly to the Pillar of Vioi and end this. The sky's a shocking shade of despair. Guess we got Lilith and Angra Mainu to thank for that. That pillar scares me more. Lilith called it the bridge to the Astral Realm, right? Only Angra Mainu can open the gate. That pillar must be like an altar for the rites. Look at the very top! It's the light the gate came from! We have to go investigate! This is the last battle for real, right? Because I am so ready for a massage! What hole did this weirdo crawl out of? It's part of Angra Mainu. Okay, so it's creepy and hostile. At least it'll be a good warm up before the final match. Reinforcements! Are those little ones also part of Angra Mainu? Yes. The feedback was the physical state. I think our attacks will work. Ah, uh, weird portal. Whoa! Go. We did go through that rift, right? It looks like we're still in the same place, but everything's all hazy. Look, the monster from before. Is it just me, or does it appear solid now? I bet it's because we went through that funky portal. I knew it was a good idea. Get lost! Not so tough now, are ya? 
don't think we'll make it very... Well, now that those spooky portal monsters are gone, what say we get a move on? I can't believe they were residing in a different dimension. It must have something to do with Angra Mainyu's powers as gatekeeper. I'm as shaken as you are, but at ah! least we... How many spare parts does Angra Mainyu have? You all know the drill now. Wait for the mini Mainyus to pop up, then blast them. Heads up, crew. We got spooky company. You Calm reap down, what you sow. You seem like normal trouble. monsters. They must have been summoned here by Angra Mainyu. Bring it up! Step on up! Ready yourself! Come on! Come on! Take this! Tell me I'm not the only one creeped out by this place. One more! How about nothing? Huh? Did you guys see that? The shadow people just disintegrated! <laughs> Must have been the light stemming from the rift. I believe we've just found our key to the Finally! I hope we never have to do that again. Jeez, shadow portal, shadow people. What's next? Let's see. Not bad. Presence okay. isn't Angra Mainyu? No. Uh -huh. It's... Huh? But that's impossible. Lyria, we're hopping between dimensions at the drop of a hat. Nothing's impossible. Revenge comes first. You saved my life! Talk later. I don't trust your hero act. After Burikin's dusted, I'm gonna make you spill your evil master plan. <laughs> Feel our sword! 
Is anyone hurt? I feel like a million rupees. But, uh, what are we gonna do about him? <sighs> Ed, wait! You want to stop Lilith too, don't you? After all the time I spent with you, I know how much you care for her. But even if you love her, after what she's done, we have to stop her. My mother. Or Lilith, I should say. Intends to sacrifice the future of this world. I know I can't let her get away with that. But I can no longer feign innocence. This has gone on long enough. You wanna come with us then? Considering the scale of violence I inflicted on your crew. Well, in the end, you did help us. <laughs> a past enemy is a future friend. That's what they say. All right. I'll join you in the fight against Lilith.
not stop her. Person, are you? Sorry. <laughs> I know you'll get the job done. Beat the weight, kid. Adoptive. We're not related by blood, but I owe her my life. If you want to turn back, no one will blame you. I've made my choice. You might say that now, but when she's right there okay. in front of you, it's gonna be tough. I'd rather face her myself. Never suffer at someone else's hands. As family, Let's you see. must feel responsible for her crimes. Don't mind if I do. Very well. We'll respect your wishes. It, there's something I wanted to ask you about. Last time we crossed swords, you transformed. Oh, yeah. What was that? If you ask me, we were going to like a giant little rat. Your time's up now. Huh? Uh, the uh, man at the station uh, of the dragon. Lilith trained when I was young. I thought I'd be saving the world. You will be, kid. That's the whole reason you joined us on this crazy mission, right? Um, what is it? I wanted to thank you for protecting me while I was imprisoned by the Church of Abia. Thanking me? I was the one who captured you. Yes, that's true. But you also helped bring me back to my friend. If you'd left me with Lilith, who knows what would have happened to me? Yeah. Yes. Unbound! I see through you! It, it's over! Monsters share a body and powers with Angra mind you. Defeat the small ones first! Understood. I get it now. The Fury can we just fought? It was like a shadow made from our memory of the real thing. Not so not only was it a counterfeit primal, it never truly existed at all. Correct? Yes. I think it's because time and space is so unstable here. Reality is getting all mixed up. But who ever heard of a shadow with the destructive force of a primal? Of Latanya. It's even tougher than the human garment. Be careful. Get lost. What the hell is this? Some kind of mating dance? Uh, is everyone all right? It's got us pinned down. We have to do something. Yeah, I know, but what? I recognize that spear. <laughs> No one goes hunting without a silver wolf! Huh? What are you doing here? Heard you got some big prey lined up. Take this! Never I got to go that wall for a few more trophies! He's not talking about melting arms. I hope not. I'd much rather have Galanza as an ally than a foe. <laughs> no autographs till after the fight. Yeah. Oh, Thank 
my breath. Wait, you're gonna sleep here? We owe you a Id, I've always wondered. When you were part of the church, why did you go to such lengths to protect Lyria? I was only following orders. At least at first. Lyria was the key to bringing salvation. But then you learned all Lilith wanted to save was herself. Lyria was no more than a means to an end. Once she had made Lyria absorb enough primals, Lilith meant to free Angramine you and sacrifice all who opposed her. I know you'll get the job! Aimed to protect her vision of salvation. When I learned it was all a lie, my life was devoid of meaning. There was nothing I wanted to fight for anymore, except Lyria. Now I'm protecting her because it's the first thing my heart's ever told me to do. The silence is unnatural. For the love of... What is it this time? Looks like weird icky stuff is coming to swallow us! Yeah, I don't like the look of that. Who knows what'll happen if we touch it? Then something... It's the primal beast from London. Please tell me that's a bad joke. For the love of... What is it this time? Looks like weird icky stuff is coming to swallow us. Yeah, I don't like the look of that. Who knows what'll happen if we touch it. Then something. It's the primal beast from London. Please tell me that's a bad joke. We don't have any real estate to fight on. No! We've reached a dead end! By the way, uh huh? Aren't you? But I suppose etiquette can wait. First, a dance! Me. 
made you decide to switch teams. Not that I don't appreciate the help, but uh, I've had my fill of bloodlusty carnivals. I never! Would you kindly refrain from comparing me to General Galanza? I am here as a matter of time. The poor John Allen, the vanquishers of my dear fellowship, suffocated in a bomb. Never the end of it. Thanks. I wasn't in a position to admire your sword play before. Let me say now, your skill with magic blades is unparalleled. That's quite flattering. Especially because you've only seen the opening act. The sword thing allied itself with Avia to bring salvation to the sky. Now at last we can rise to the occasion. My, my. Looks like the tempo's about to pick up. That haste Get away from the snake! Going for our footholds! Other than the miniature dragon, I don't suppose any of you can fly? Finally, it stopped flailing. Now get in there. Catalina, I'll protect you! Fall down! 
Mistake, Skyfarers. This was merely a matter of honor. Do not disgrace yourselves by thanking me. And so, I bid you adieu. believe we're still breathing. If Magliel hadn't come, we'd probably be s'mores by now. It's too soon to celebrate. Come on. Ceiling's gotten higher. Should mean we're almost at the top. The more I see that sky, the more I hate it. Yeah, Luba's got some messed up taste. This should be the last battle. Make sure you're prepared. Is that the gate to the Astral Realm? It looks even scarier up close. Strange, isn't it? Gateways are usually a symbol of hope and new opportunity. Not this one. Like Roland said, if that door opens, then the skies will fall. We won't let it open. Yep, we'll beat Lilith, grab Roland. Had you only seen things my way, this pitiful fate could have been avoided. Why must you insist on quarreling with your own brethren? It's unfathomable, truly. <laughs> ah, shaman. Impeccable timing, as always, I see. Can you feel the grip of imminent salvation? I invite you and your other half to watch. <laughs> and it is this betrayal? <laughs> hmm. Where did I go wrong? You can't sacrifice our skies to open that gate! We won't let you do it! Once I reach Estelusia, I shall guide this world to Utopia. Why would anyone reject my heartfelt invitation? Ah, <sighs> how I pity you poor misguided creatures. Yeah, like we give a crap about anything you say. <laughs> Your messed up Utopia is built on sacrifice. No way we're letting that fly. <sighs> Options fail me. I can no longer sway your hearts or minds. As a parting gift, may you all find solace in death's warm embrace. This is how it happens! 
has to be! It? Please, don't disappoint me any further. You can still redeem yourself. Eradicate these nuisances and come back to Mother. No. Please listen to me. I think you've lost sight of the big picture. Never but enough. these skies when compared to all of eternity. I can just absorb Angra Mainu. <laughs> I'm afraid that's impossible. Angra Mainu is completely under my command. Oh, it seems I'm the children power. Astraeus, be a dear, won't you? Damn! Hang in there, Roland! We're gonna save you! Why, Drago? The sooner you accept death and grace, the sooner you can be at peace. Mother, please. You have to understand. This isn't salvation. It's destruction! Celebrations, but we're not done yet. For a fraction of my soul, I'll buy all your death. The power's flowing into Angra Mainu. She's attempting a fusion. Is she that desperate to live on, even if it means she'll stop being an astral? Great gatekeeper, Angra Mainu, I beseech you, bequeath your power onto me. Take this vessel, I am yours! <laughs> Something terrible is coming. Submitted, it wouldn't have come to this. 
truce with Angra, mind you? Yeah, but at least your back fixed it, dude. Glad we got you out in one piece. You really went to extraordinary length to save me. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart, there's much more I want to say. But it will have to wait. Angra, mind you, has grown too powerful. I understand. Why are you so invested in our skies? Don't let the pressure get to you. Just focus on beating them one at a time. They just keep coming. How are we supposed to take the armor you now? Break it, man. I think I can buy us some time. I need everyone to gather around. I love it when other people make the plans. Fight your way to rolling, everyone. Unless you plan on walking home. Quite a raucous affair we have here. before it gets more out of hand. Join us one. The world rests in our hands. What fun is a death match if my opponents are already dead? This is the moment of truth. Do not falter. Whatsoever you decide, we will follow your lead. Each shot costs us a mill. Okay, so what? Those folks are betting their lives out there. So shut your yaps and keep firing! Everyone's here! Our bonds are stronger than ever. We shall prevail! Let's show her what's up, Captain. Us Sky Dwellers are taking a stand. Yeah! Madness. The skies are counting on us! That was fun. That's what you made of, boys! 
Your megalomania is a threat. No matter where you are, I will never let you return to Estelucia! Make things right again! That you were speaking. No one person can determine right or wrong. No one will believe your life. Not anymore! Do it! Let's go! Well done! Send them all back to their home! It's over! Move! We can handle them! Oh yeah! Here, here! Let's just focus on the path ahead. Strike through! Don't go crying home to mama! Track it! You know! It's over! Captain, I'm ready! Not now, not ever! Catalina, I'll protect you! The shine has won! The astrophism! Now that's team, do it again! Are you kidding me? Those giant hands are back! Yeah, along with those lugs from before. Let's just hope the shadows don't turn up again. Destroy the new arrivals. We can't afford any distractions. Distractions? Is the understatement of the century? These damn laser beams. Your mark! Nice finish. How's you that? Indeed. Bet you wish you hadn't messed with us now.
Your sins are grave, too great to measure. Don't you see? You were wrong to think of sacrificing this world and its people. It's not too late. It. I'll accept my fate, so please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I haven't been truthful with you from the start. Spill forth from thy vessel, and awaken. Claim thy divine right. The sky is once more yours to sunder and renew. Primeval dragon, child of darkness and flames! Uh, you can't! It's okay. Let me be the one to save you. Huh? Perhaps I acted in haste. So swiftly you sensed the dimensional distortion. Oh, meddlesome wings. You who defy the stars. You will sleep within this child, until I have further need of you. <laughs> Come, the stars await, and we mustn't keep them. The true beginning stirs.
Id had become a dragon and vanished into the somber skies. His roar, which echoed like a distant peal of thunder, electrified me with sadness. <sighs> Can't believe it. I thought if we beat Angra Mainyu, we'd be free to go on our merry way. No kidding! Why did it have to go off and become Bahamut? Right. In which case... Hey, what are you thinking about, Moan? It's like you've got all your gears whirring. It's starting to come together now. Especially if she used a Mind Sealer on him. The Mind Sealer is what they used to rob Lyria of her free will. What does it have to do with Bahamut? Everything. Lilith and Bahamut, destruction and rebirth, everything is linked. How about giving us the gist? Essentially, it comes down to why Lilith failed to wake Angramainu 15 years ago. I heard the Sky Realm's Bahamut appeared after sensing an overwhelming astral presence. Perhaps that was more than rumor. You call that the gist? I'm even more confused. I'm sorry. Fifteen years ago, Lilith summoned Angra Mainyu. At the same time, Bahamut manifested to face her. But this was not the same Bahamut you all know. Let us call it Bahamut Versa. It sensed the unfathomable power of Angra Mainyu and consumed it. Stopping Lilith in her tracks. But now... Perhaps, to remove Bahamut from the picture, Lilith trapped the Primal inside Id, using the Mind Sealer. Okay, but that doesn't explain why she suddenly freed Versa. Does she want to wreck the skies, or what? She once told Id that she would destroy the world to bring about its rebirth. Versa is more than capable of forcing reincarnation upon the Sky Realm. In any case, we know one thing for sure. If we leave Versa to its own devices, it will be the end of all life as we know it. You gotta be kidding! How are we gonna defeat a World Crusher? And what's gonna happen to Id? You aren't asking us to kill him, are you? Not gonna happen. Thank you. He doesn't deserve debt. Huh. Still got a debt to settle with that punk. Can't let him off so easily. How do you know Id's still in there? Even Bahamut's got nothing on Id. Exactly guy with a stick that far up his butt? Even an apocalyptic dragon couldn't push him down. Even if we can't get through to him, he'll survive a beating. He trounced us, right? <sighs> I've been around for a long time, but you Sky Dwellers never cease to surprise me. I never would have dreamed that a single crew could save Tempeel. Or pacify Excavalion. Or defeat Angra Mainyu? But you've taught me that it's not longevity or physical strength that's important. It's the power of your heart. You have my complete faith. I believe that nothing in all the world will keep you from saving your friend. It's settled. We snap Versa like a pinata till it coughs up in. Yeah! Don't mind if I do. All right, let's go. This world is precious. I mean, even the God of Destruction can't bear to lose it. Our bodies might be mortal, 
but our hearts are infinite. Though he's in a dark place right now, I hope Id doesn't lose sight of that. But even if he does, I'll open his eyes again. I, this crew, will never abandon someone we care about. The sunrise spills over the Grand Cipher as we rush on the winds, chasing the sorrowful cries of a faraway dragon. Support. I won't waste it! The spell is perfect! And yet... Seems the binding is only half effective. <laughs> Captain, the rest is up to you. You must save it. Also to blame for the failures of my people. And I swear to you now, I will set things right again. I don't like to admit it, but gods are a little the 
beyond our skill level. We need more firepower. I think you mean dragon power. Lyrian, can you feel up to summoning Bahamut? Okay, just give me some time. That is the light of the apocalypse. The fire of doomsday. Its power is transcendent. If the attack lands, all the sky will be obliterated. Here it comes! I'm the Sacred Earth! The Antigen Kenona! <laughs> Neo! Let's go! Chicken! This is going to be down! How about Kenona? Oh, yeah. Leave it to me! Your time's up now, Huggy! It's over! Captain! My turn now! Get the way! Bring it! The Astrophysm! <laughs> you hold the charge! But it's already stored up considerable energy! Quick try to fry your stag, Mammoth! Everyone, gather around me! Gotta beat up! Get to the area! Now! I'll keep you all safe! I promise! How could Shackles that bind into Versa, he'll come back! You reap what you sow. Here goes! Versa! Got it! Coming right up! Oh, Don't you remember? You made a promise! Is this your idea of protecting Lyria? You finally crawled out from under Lilith's thumb? And now you're gonna let yourself be crushed under Versa? There's a little thing I can throw. I will bleed him! You can't push us away! Without us, you're pretty much the awkward person I've ever met! <laughs> He's right, kid. Faith, you need us. I thought you knew us better than that, Id. None of us would ever abandon a friend. Have a face full of Take this! That's my business! 
it sooner no use running anymore I am who I am an evil dragon child of darkness and flame my name is <laughs>
absolutely amazing. You've suppressed Versus Core and driven it back to its home dimension. Is everyone safe now? Thanks for everything. <laughs> you can buy me some apples on the way back. Huh? We're still not done. Forgive me. Hmm. Kids these days, you two are totally nuts. <gasps> Place far away? Hey, this ain't the time for jokes. He and Bahamut are trapped on another plane. Think of it as a sliver between dimensions. Still, considering his transceiver seems to be working. For now. Sadly, I think my time's almost up. The line's going to get cut earlier than I'd hoped. Thought I'd still be able to open a gate from here. Guess not. Isn't there anything we can do? Sure, just stay calm. No need to worry about little old me. I'm Mr. Fixit, remember? There's no jam I can't get myself out of, you know. I'll make it. That's 
where we bumped into Roland when we first arrived in the Zega Grande Skydom. I have to atone. Huh? For Mother's crimes. And mine. Come on, no need to beat yourself up, kid. That's right. We couldn't have resolved this without you. said it was fine, right? Yeah. <laughs> One of us now. Got me? Never forget everything you've done. Never ever. <laughs> and when we find Roland, we'll give him the thanks he deserves. We've met so many people in the Zega Grande sky. New friends. New allies. saw a man torn in two by family and betrayal. We were saved by an immortal who found beauty in our changing world. Through loss and adversity, our resolve brought Lyria and I closer than ever before. Yet this story is far from over. A good friend is still out there waiting for us to come get him. And as for our journey, there's still much to say. To the ends of the skies, where the stars reside, someday we will reach Estelusia.